going on guys? It's KW Games 580 here, and we're gonna be doing some Skyrim. I probably should have started a new, like a fresh thing for the stream, but you know, stuff happens. So right now I'm doing a stream for Skyrim, as the title says, and we're doing Dark Brotherhood questline. Um, I just got recruited into the Dark Brotherhood earlier today, <coughs> and we're going to be going in and doing some of the bounties. Uh, I just thought about this, like just thought of this, so I've already done two of my bounties, sorry. Uh, we're going to be just running bounties for the Dark Brotherhood, killing some fools, hello viewer, how's your day? So, we're gonna be heading off. And Austin spamming high in the chat. What's up, Austin? Second viewer of the day. How is your day? Seven. How am I feeling? Um, meh. A bit yucky, but I'll be okay. Um, Doc just prescribed to me on some new steroids, so we'll see how that works out. Battle armor. Let's do this. Okay. Gonna want to whip this bow out here. Okay, so this is an elder dragon. They're pretty. Uh, well, they're in between. Alright, let's pause this. You gonna come back to school? Uh, actually, I'm gonna be doing Liberty U online until I get better. So. Let's see here. Alright, we got some gold and stuff off of them. Uh, oh, yo! Oh, I thought that was something actually valuable. Dragon shell, let's see. Let's go for that. Frost, frost breath. Alright. Uh, got a new shout here. That's that's always fun. Your breath is winter, you Thuma blizzard. Okay, so that's that's kinda cool actually. So where was I heading off to again? Oh yeah, Dawnstar. Alright, so we'll fast travel to the Hall of the Vigilant. Uh, we're gonna be heading off to Dawnstar to pull off in a quick little assassination here. Um, so, yeah. What we're gonna be going for now is <coughs> just assassinations. Okay, so Dragon Soul Absorb, cool. Now let's head off to Dawnstar. So now we're just going to be doing this. All right, so we've got some hostiles right here. Well, they're not really hostiles until you get close to them. Then they go hostile. So we're going to be getting some mammoth cheese and whatnot. All right, so they just put hostile. We'll be hopefully getting these guys killed pretty quickly. Pop dragon aspect. Oh, crap. I can only use that one once a day. Uh, we'll use Marked for Death. I just got that one, so I don't know what it is. Okay, so it's kind of like a health drain. That's kind of cool. I don't 
know why I didn't do in the attacks. Hey, Bean. Alright, so... Where'd this man's run off to? Is he hiding inside the mammoth? Good grief. Alright, so we got mammoth tusks. We don't need that. Giant. Alright, just so you guys know, this is a modded character. Uh, well, uh, it's, it's pretty heavily modded. <laughs> but it's not like anything crazy, it's just kinda extra little things to shape up. Bean. Alright, so I'm gonna quickly show you guys the mods I got installed. I'm going for a more realistic feel on it. So that's why I have a lot of the mods that I have on here. Nothing weird. Or at least I don't think they're weird. So, the mods we got pulled up here are such as... Rich Merchants of Skyrim, Immersive Citizens, Unlimited Sprinting, Katana Pack, Sarcastic Loading Screens, Free Crafting Resurrection, Weightless Dragon Bones, and Scales Fastering, Leveling, Better Loot, Immersive Patrols Populated, Skyrim Civil War, Lootable Giants, Immersive Movement, and the Marriage Mod. There's nothing that happens in between the characters, you just get some extra dialogue and exposition, that's all. Also, you get good deals on the merchants that if you marry one of them, so that's another reason. <laughs> Alright, let's see who we got here. Also, just so you guys can see, uh, oh shoot. One second here. Where'd he go? What the heck? Alright, so just so you guys can see my character, this is my heavy armor set. It's the Daedric armor. When we throw on my. Oh shoot, yeah, I forgot. I still have this on me. I meant to get rid of this just like drop it off at my house but I still have it uh, this is the vampire lord outfit you get from doing the vampire quest line and don't join the dawn guard you side on the vampire's steam and the headgear I have right now is from Calidicus the vile from returning his dog and axe do not kill the dog with the axe unless you want the axe then, then you can do that but it's still, in my opinion, you do that, you're just a bad person. This is my assassin outfit, and this is my companion, Serana. She is the Vampire Lord's daughter that helped me kill her dad. <laughs> so, and, okay, who's this guy? Cool. Also, my character's the Khajiit vampire. So, I'm a werewolf, a cat humanoid, and a vampire. <laughs> <coughs> and uh, the blades I'm using, Daedric Katana from the Katana Pack. Um, I've got a bunch of different kinds of arrows. The Nightingale Bow, which you get from doing the, uh, what was it, the Thieves Guild quest line. Same with the blade. <coughs> and Ariel's Bow, you also get that from doing the um, quest line with the vampires. Uh, yeah, but a lot of these quests are actually pretty hard to do, man. They're just annoying. <laughs> Alright, so, let's continue. Oh, dang it. Okay, so, oh, shoot, didn't mean to do that, okay. Okay. So, if any of you guys have any questions, sorry, I was pulling up the stream again on my chat, I accidentally closed it. Sorry, the chat on my stream. Uh, if any of you guys have any questions, just type them in the chat. I will read them as soon as I get the chance to. Alright, so we just discovered Dawnstar. We're going to be heading in for the assassination now. There's the target. Okay, so we'll just whip out the bow. Target is down. And here's where do I have that invisibility potion still? It's this is gonna get a little bit messy if I don't. Okay. Poof! And now I can run away. See, I'm invisible. 
you can actually see the little bit of like shroud there all right so show me the houses all right i will show you my living spaces and homes right after i report back to this guy at the um dark brotherhood they will not disappoint you or at least i hope they won't disappoint you <laughs> so I stocked up on all three of the bounties, you guys. I only did one on this stream so far, because I didn't think about it yet. So, uh, basically, this, this, this... You gotta do, like, a weird thingy to summon the Dark Brotherhood assassinations. And in order to trigger this, like, in order to join, you have to, uh... help this child kill an abusive orphanage owner. So after you kill that, and you wait like 24 hours, then you go back to a house and sleep, you'll wake up and you'll have to kill one of the random three. Uh, if it gives you the option to kill the Khajiit, kill him. I'm not sure if you, it actually affects if you choose, but I do know for a fact that that's what worked for me. Keep talking, little man, and we'll see who gets punished. I'll be quiet. Alright, and right there, that's another thing where you can get a dragon shout. That's how I got marked for death. You just walk up and to, you just walk up to that one and you get the shout. Alright. Haven't you talked to Astrid? She's by the pool greeting the night mother and her little jester. She has a contract for you. Come see me afterward. Haven't you talked to Astrid? Dang it, I don't know. Okay, fine. I just wanted to turn my bounties in, man. All right. All right. So we'll just unmark those three. Also, the Dark Brotherhead has a pet spider. Apparently, I don't want to try to kill it because what if I get like in trouble for it? But you know. Also, that little girl right there is 300 years old. She's a vampire and an assassin. Alright, time to listen to the dialogue. No mistake. I am the leader of this sanctuary. My word is law. Are we clear on that point? Oh, yes, mistress. Perfectly. You're the boss. Ah, oh, there you are. Good. I think that guy's gonna get killed. Speaking with that muttering fool anyway. Yeah, he's definitely gonna get killed. <laughs> I do indeed. You must go to the city of Markarth and speak with the apothecary's assistant. You'll probably find her in the hag's cure when the shop is open. The girl's been running her mouth. Wants an ex-lover killed. She's apparently performed the black sacrament. Her name is Muiri. I need you to talk to her, set up the contract, and carry it out. Oh yeah, um, by the way, stream. Be professional. Not family friendly. This game is not this is not okay for kids. Just in case. Hey, you want Okay, so we'll close that bounty for now and we'll just head on out and that door always scares me, man. It's just weird. When I first walked up to it, it straight up talked to me, dude. I kid you not. Hello, Serana. Alright. So we're gonna pop in Markarth right quick. I'll show you that house. I've got a house in Markarth, a house in... Uh, not Helgen. Uh, Falkreath, Whiterun, Winterhold. Sorry, not Winterhold. Windhelm. Uh, get out of my way. Alright, so. And. One in. Where was the other one at? Uh. Solitude. I've got a house in Solitude as well. Alright, so. We're just gonna head on in. That's not the house I'm looking for. That's for the quest line for Forsworn Conspiracy. This is my house right here. Doesn't look like much on the outside, but when you go in, 
is pretty sick. If it would load. <laughs> Usually it just takes like five seconds, probably just because I'm streaming it's taking a bit longer. Okay. So you come in, this is the main hall. You got some plants on either side. This is the living room. That's my friend. He came with the house. Uh, this is the alchemy room, where I make potions and whatnot. Uh, this armor you get from doing the quest line with her. As far as I know, it's exclusive to that quest. I am not sure. <coughs> uh, when you come into here, this is the armory slash enchanting room. This is the Blade of the Reach. It's a two-handed battle axe. And that is her dad's blade, her sword. Uh, and then right here we've got the Mace of Malagabal. And the Sword of Dawnbreaker. Those are both Daedric weapons, which you get from doing special quest lines. And right quick, I got this off of her dad as well, the Vampire Royal Armor. And speaking of which, I need to drop that armor off somewhere. I'll drop that off at my main house. So, we come in here, this is the bedroom. So, then we'll go here. This is the dining room. Into the next room we go. Uh, right here, this is the guest room where uh, that guy right there stays. So, I don't even know his name. <laughs> He's got like a gnarly tattoo on his face though, and a uh, scar on his r right under his right eye. <coughs> okay, so now we'll go to the house in Solitude. It's right next to the Blue Palace. So, when we go in here, just so you know, I'm not doing this uh, to flex on you guys. We got a comment request from Flame, aka Bean. I've seen him on a lot of my streams. So, he requested to see these houses. And right here, I believe this one is my house, I believe. Yep, Proud Spire Manor. That's mine. <coughs> so, we go inside. And, again with the loading. Uh, okay, so, here we go. When you first come in, you've got the alchemy. It's kind of a mess. Uh, right here, I have no clue what this is. It just kind of came with the house. I think it's a guest room or something. Uh, bookshelf, it's just where I keep a bunch of these weird notes that I found in my house and wooden helm. Uh, so we go in here. This is the armory slash enchanting room. That's just where I keep kind of a blend of armor. And speaking of this one right here, I need to put some new armor on here. Change the helmet. Change that. Boom. Now it's got the vampire armor on. And we'll just take that. And I'll sell those to someone later. We, right here we got a bunch of notes and stuff. Uh, speaking of those notes, I need to ma transport those back to my main house. So take all. Take, okay. So on to the first floor. That right there was the basement. This is the first floor. Uh, again, that person came with the house. Honor to you, my friend. Um, my character's name is Meow because he's a cat. So it makes it lightens the mood seriously whenever I'm in a, like an intense situation, and someone sends me a letter like asking for my help in like the sin most sincerest of manners, but like they started off with, "Dear Meow." <laughs> yeah, wait, what the heck? Why do I have this? Okay, whatever. 
I'll just hang on to that. <laughs> What's in the safe? Alright, so I'll take that. I'm, I just realized I'm robbing myself live. Alright, so let's pull the chat out. Sorry, the, uh, wait, actually, is it showing? Let's see. Yeah, on my phone, the 15th comment is not showing up, sorry. My apologies. So we'll head to out into solitude. Oh! Okay, so now it showed up. Yes, it is a little bit funny. So now we'll go to the first house I got, which is a, not a manor, it's just a normal house in Whiterun. Okay, those exploring in the Skyrim steepest underground reaches should be wary of the chorus. Giant insect that spits out ouchies and bites with its razor sharp TVs. <laughs> Sarcastic loading screens are the best. Missed call, I guess. Whatever. I picked up. I don't know why it didn't let me talk. Okay, Orcish War Axe of Flames. That's a pretty cool thing to come with the house. Alright, so this is just a small house that I got here in White Run. It cost me 5k. Need, I'm the Thane of this city, Solitude, and another city. So, whenever you become the Thane, they give you a house car, which is basically a servant, I guess. <coughs> Answer. Hello. <laughs> yes. You know what? You, you want to try that? Guess what? BAM! Now you can't have the stream, you scrub. <laughs> Eat that. <laughs> so... <laughs> so, uh... What we're gonna do now is... Okay, uh... Vampire powers grow as a hunger. You're back! Okay. Could I oh, get a few gold to spend? A few please? gold? No, you can't. You can't have a little bit. You can have a lot. No way with, with this. I, I could buy everything in the market. Wow, thanks. <laughs> no. Alright, so when we're going outside, this is the place we've got. It's just kind of a bit. This is where I set everything up and built it. This is Lakeview Manor right outside of Falkreath. There's a bandit camp on the way here that I cleared out. It's just over there. So you'll have to kill those guys if you want to um, set up here. Uh, one thing that is noticeable, if, that, sorry, notable, if you set up here, um, every now and again when you come outside, there will be like a group of bandits right, right here that will try to attack you and a good spot to go right next to your house. This cave down here, it's got some loot. At the price of a couple of wolves. Uh, a lot of this stuff is just what I dropped here. But the only things that actually spawned here originally are this chest. Which, let's see what's inside. Okay, so it's to the left. Boom. Alright. Alright, so as you can see, that's some pretty good stuff right there. Um, another thing you should definitely worry about if you set here, like, if you build your house here, is just over here, as you can see, your house is right there, right? So you go down here, and there's a necromancer that will spawn, originally here, a couple of times. Uh, on the bright side, it's a free weapon that spawns right here, so you'll get that in a book as well. Uh, that will upgrade your conjuration. So, now that I've showed you guys what you need to look out for and stuff, 
if you do set up here. Uh, now I'll give you the guys the actual house tour. So, right out. so that's where I keep my chickens. Stables for the horse that died in combat. Um, we go in here. So this opening part isn't much, but it's something. It's pretty nice. Okay, so what we'll do is just we'll close that so you guys can't see in while well, I'm just showing this. So this is the original thing that you get to build before you get to choose your schematics. Everything branches off this one spot. So that's a lot of chickens. Yeah, I've got three chickens. I think two of them got killed though. So we go in here. This is the armory. Um, we've got a storm cloak set, a couple of glass katanas on the wall, which actually, uh, glass in this game is what they call malachite. So this is a imperial captain set. This is an imperial commander set. This is a uh, what was it called? Dawn Guard. This is a Dawn Guard heavy armor set. And this is a Thieves Guild Commander set. Two steel katanas, because those are cool. <coughs> and we this is the dining hall, the main hall. That is my wife. Okay. So we go in here. This is the bedrooms. We got two orcish katanas. We got my son that I adopted from Windhelm. And my daughter that I adopted from Whiterun. So, this is the chest where all the get- sorry, no, the one on the right. This is the- get out of my way. This is the chest where all the things that you give them and they, they gather go. So, if you ever want to be that guy and steal from your kids, <laughs> this is where you do it. Um, a lot of the- all of these knives are things that I've given them. Just cause you might as well get them started training early so they know how to handle themselves in case of a home intruder. Like my dad did with my guns. And then we go into here. This is the entrance to the cellar. Which is right there. This is the storage room. We've got a lot of boxes. This is the safe where I keep my extra potions. There's a lot of potions. Uh, we pop this chest open. This is the spare weaponry. Dawn Guard Warhammer, Dawn Guard War Axe, Blade of Sacrifice, uh, Giant Club, and a Legendary Crossbow. Crack this open. This is where I keep the ingredients. Uh, do not sell your Daedra Hearts. Those are very important in order to make Daedric armor and Daedric weapons. So. And to put the extra ingredients in there. Okay. So, yeah, this is the storage room. Um, and then in here, we've got more katanas. These are ebony katanas, which are basically black steel. Um, so, now what we'll do is we'll put. Let's see, what do we want to put in there? Put a couple of those in there, Ruby. Alright, so this is the gem box. <laughs> We've got six amethyst, an amethyst paragon, a common soul gem, eight diamonds, a diamond claw, ebony claw, four emeralds, an emerald paragon, seven flawless amethyst, eight flawless diamonds, two flawless emeralds, nineteen flawless garnets, twelve flawless rubies, eight flawless sapphire, five garnets, six grand soul gem, six filled, sorry, seven filled grand soul gems, five greater soul gems, Three filled greater soul gems, three heart stone, initiates your uh, lesser soul gem. But the reason this is in here, it's made out of like silver and moonstone. So, petty soul gem, lesser soul gem, petty soul gem. Right eye of the falmer. Uh, you get this from a giant Buddha statue looking thing. They weigh five pounds and were worth 2.5k gold. Uh, 14 rubies and two sapphires. Can I have some diamonds? Sure. I find them pretty easy. So you can have some. Oh, I forgot. This is the extra armor chest. Uh, you get this from doing a quest line with Boethia, the goddess of darkness, I think. Uh, this is the nightingale armor. You get this from doing the Thieves Guild set. It makes you look like Batman. I don't remember where I got this. 
I just put, picked it up and stole it because it looked cool. Uh, this is a dragon priest armor. Like, sorry, mask. Uh, ebony, falmer, ebony, falmer, ebony, falmer. Glass, glass, glass rings. Uh, do I keep it in here? Let's see. Let's see. In my opinion, oh wait, we need to put the. Yeah, I keep this because I work with the Dark Brotherhood, so I, I just kind of put this on anyone who's unconscious. Just kind of throw that on them and kill them. Uh, this is my mage outfit, the Master Robes. <laughs> Magicka regenerates 150% faster. Uh, this is another Dragon Priest mask, and I upgraded it to flawless. It gives 50 magic and destruction and restoration spells ca cost 20% less to cast. And then we go up here to the second floor. This is my uh, Storm Cloak Commander outfit that I got. Don't know why it doesn't put the hat on there, but it doesn't. This is where I enchant. Um, we go into here, guest bedroom. In here, this is the bookshelf where I keep all my books. And this knapsack right here is where I keep letters. I don't put actual books in there. Alright, so yeah, this is where I keep all my notes. And whatnot. Okay, so now that you guys have seen everything except the basement and the balconies, we'll go down to the basement. The reason I said this is my main house is because it was the second house I purchased. Sorry, the second property I purchased. I built the house. Uh, this is the blade outfit you get. Um, these are the different Daedric Shrines. So, uh, di all the different kinds of katanas. Golden Katana. Uh, Orcish, I think that one is. Yeah, Orcish. Glass, Steel, Ebony. And we got two gold on the wall right there. Uh, mead Barrels, so you can get some Nord Mead to sell. Uh, I don't use it because it does give you 30 stamina, but then, sorry, not 30, it does give you stamina, yeah, 15 stamina, but then your stamina regenerates 30% slower for 30 seconds, it's not worth it. Uh, this is the blacksmith room. Right there is the uh, ebony axe of immobilizing, and the ebony sword of fire, and the ebony shield of frost abatement. And right here is different ores and stuff. Safes all across the wall. And again across the wall there. Uh, we crack this chest open. This is where I keep different jewelry and extra, just kind of extra stuff in general. I'll take that ring because it looks, sorry, that necklace because it looks awesome. Um, get out of my way, please. Uh, we crack this chest open. This is where I keep building materials and stuff like that. Speaking of which, put those goat horns in there. Do I still have that vampire ash? Things I need to know, but I don't. <laughs> so this is just building materials and crafting stuff. So, yeah. And then we've got a couple extra swords in there because I'm lazy and I don't want to move it. So, yeah. And now for the balconies. <laughs> How long will the stream be? Hello, you said steam, but I know what you meant. Uh, I don't know. Just kinda gonna be... Whenever I start to feel bad or I have to do something that'll take a while in real life, that's when I'll hop off the stream. I'll probably start it back up. Uh, that's an apiary where you can get like bees and honeycombs and whatnot. Archery out here on the balcony. Uh, you can tan some stuff. That's another mead barrel, so you can sell it. You go out onto this balcony, more mead barrels. 
a lot of the stuff you see, like the alcohols and whatnot, came with the house. Hello, third and fourth viewer. How is your day going? I will get on when I finish the stream. Okay. Okay. That's pretty cool. Um, so... Now for the next house. Uh, stream, just so you guys know, uh, I'm just doing a few house tours real quick, because a couple of guys in chat requested it. Uh, then we're going to be doing the Dark Brotherhood quest line. Windhelm is my least favorite house, because it's the house of a murderer. Well, at least it was before I bought it. And then the quest for it is actually glitched. I literally cannot complete it. Because when I go to investigate the crime scene, it's bugged, and the crime scene isn't there. So I straight up can't do the quest line to fix my house. Okay, as a Bloodstar vampire, I am hated and feared. That's why I keep this. Boom. Now I'm no longer hated and feared. I'm just kind of chilling. Alright, so... Right down here, uh is where the crime scene is. There's supposed to be like blood stains and stuff all over this coffin right here. As you can see, there's not. Um, so yeah. The house it gives you is right up here and to the left. So, I'm not actually sure if we can get there from here. Yeah, here we go. So we go around and... Oop, didn't mean to do that, sorry. Uh, we'll go around and through here. This is the house. Um, as you'll be able to see, there is, like, murder stuff. It's an empty house. You can see blood stains right there. Um, and when we go here, it's like a fake back wall here that you get to crack open. If I can... Yeah, see? So. And yeah. The murder is called the Butcher. So we'll go through here. <coughs> oh, my throat. Man, I just feel gunked up right now, man. Alright, so... Yeah, it's just kind of set up like that. Um, like I said, the house is empty, except for, like, the murder room that you, that you guys just saw a second ago. Uh, I believe that's it. Let me think. I went home. Alright, so... Windhelm, check. Whiterun, check. Lakeview Manor, check. Markarth, and... Uh, the Swan in Solitude, yeah. Alright, so back to the Dark Brotherhood. We'll reactivate our contracts. And we're heading in. After this, guys, uh, I will probably be doing either a Rainbow Six stream, an H1Z1 stream, or a Battlefield stream. Just depends on which one Ben wants to play. I have not been doing streams and videos recently because I just haven't been feeling well recently. Being an apprentice is great. I can uh, so I'm actually having an okay day and stuff, and there's nothing for me to do. Like I did all my chores yesterday and whatnot, so I don't have anything to do. So yeah. this is kind of a perfect day for the stream. The Dark Brotherhood. Oh, oh. I... My goodness, you're really here. The Black Sacrament. It actually worked. <laughs> what, I need, what I need is for Elaine Dufont to die. I want him hunted down and murdered like the dog he is. Heesh. I didn't know it when we were with each other, but Elaine is actually the leader of a band of cutthroats. Bandits. Ooh, bandits. They're holed up in some old dwarven ruin. Ralde Bathar. Oh, dang it's near I hate, I hate doing, like, uh, dwarven ruins. They're so annoying. I want you to go to that ruin, find Elaine Dufont, and kill him. I don't care about his friends. 
do whatever you want with them. But Elaine has to die. Excellent. All right. Once Elaine is dead, I'll pay you in gold. I've saved up a bit. I hope that'll do. I don't need your gold, lady. Well, there is one more thing. If you're interested. If you can, I want you to kill someone else as well. You don't have to, not as part of our deal, but if you do, I'll pay you even more. It's Nilsen Shattershield in Windhelm. If Nilsen dies too, I'll make it worth your while. Alright. Make them all pay for what they've done to me. So, we'll be killing the guy in the Dwarven Ruins first, and then we'll head to the guy in the city. Because just genuinely, it's harder to uh, kill a guy in a city because there's more guards patrolling the area. So, we will assassinate Elaine Dufont first. <laughs> and we'll report back after. Uh, we kill the other guy too. I'm pr what I'm probably gonna do is I'm gonna use like an invisibility potion if I have one I and if I don't I'll just go stealthing all right so hello mr. Jelanki or whatever how you, however you pronounce your name sorry if I butchered that uh, let's see what we got here so we'll be going this way now uh, what Basically what this stream is, it's just going to be me running and doing the bounties for the uh, Dark Brotherhood. Come on, if I can hop out. Dang, what the heck just happened? I just popped back in. Okay, whatever. Can I get to land now? Thank you. Okay, so am I heading the right way? Yes, I am. Okay. So we are on our way to kill Elaine Dufont. If you kill him in the town, you might take an arrow to the knee. <laughs> yeah, I uh, actually, it's not one specific NPC that gives that line. Uh, pretty much any guard of the, like, the city guards, any of them can say it. It's just a random line. The, I used to be an adventurer like you until I took an arrow to the knee. Any of them say it. Uh... Where the heck is my companion? Did they die? Nope, there they are. Okay. Okay, so. Where do we need to head? Okay, so we're gonna go up the mountain, I guess? Yeah. Oh, there's stairs up there. So we're gonna be heading into some Dwemer ruins. Um, to kill this guy. Let's just see what we get in reward. They did say they'd make it worth my while. Uh,. My personal rule, I usually, unless it's a really easy kill, I won't do it unless I get paid 500 gold or more, but, yeah, so, I can, okay, shoot. Right, he's dead, serpentine, serpentine. Okay, so that's another one dead. Okay, he's dead. Next. Here we go. Yeah, they weren't lying when they said they were held up in some dwarven ruins. Just, I wouldn't be surprised if I ended up having to fight some of the robots that the uh, dwarves have. Yep. Okay, so that's a pressure plate. That's actually a trap right there. Um... We'll quickly just... And you're dead. Uh, this is my companion, Serana. You get from you get her from doing the vampire quest. Okay. So... I am also a vampire, so fire is not a good thing for me. Shoot. You know what? Just bump it. Oh, wow. I actually managed to just jump over the fire. <laughs> Alright, that's pretty cool. Uh, we'll just try to... Okay. So it's not that one. I have a ton of lockpicks, so this will... It will be a bit boring, but it, it we will get this guy pretty easily. We'll just... 
You know, I probably should have checked his bandit friends. Yeah, I might go check his bandit friends for a lock. Like, for a key to that lock. Who cares about the fire rule? Whatever. You know. He didn't have a key on him. Shoot. Get out of my way. Okay, so we'll go through. Maybe there's a way around. <laughs> he called me a hero earlier. I am the exact opposite, my friend. Yo, wait, what the heck? Oh yeah, I forgot Serana can bring enemies back to the dead from the dead to fight for us. So that's actually kind of cool, but it makes for some good jump scares for sure. You okay, you know what? Sit down, fool. Uh, let's see what we got here. Yes, another way in. Alright, so we'll quick save before we attack. We'll just go in sneaky. Okay. So now that that guy's dead... Okay. Hey, sit down. Foo. Alright, so let's see what this guy had. Since he was the assassination target. Oh, he actually had a decent weapon. Okay. Emphasis on decent. It will most definitely make for a good trophy mount. If not that, uh, it, it I mean gold. <laughs> I could sell it for gold. So. Let's just... I wonder what that trap does. Nothing? Okay. Must have been deactivated. Let's go. Alright, so we're gonna go in. Uh, be a little bit sneaky about it. I'm not sure if I want to do it with a bow and arrow or a sword. We'll just have to figure it out. Cancel the charge spell by yelling at it. <laughs> okay. The High King of Sarantark was recently killed by a bull. Okay. That's edgy. The heck? Cat lady walking around. Okay. Wait, is this guy the target? Seriously? Oh, it's a girl. Wait, seeing as how the assassination was on an ex lover and now I'm killing a girl, I have a feeling that it was. Oh, okay. <laughs> and I'm caught. Alright, let's just. Ow. Shot in the back. Um, what's a good way out of here? We'll just dip through here. And we're home free. Easy. There will be a couple of guards outside the city, but that'll be pretty easy. <laughs> because the US. Takes a long time to deliver my PC. Dang. Become friends with someone and they may allow you to take certain items from their home group. Okay, wow. Well. Yep, called it. There'd be a couple of guards out here. You know what? Always a good idea is. Nothing like a good old killing spree. Alrighty. Oh, 
she's stone. I can't use healing hands on her because she's a vampire and that doesn't work for some reason. So, this is just gonna happen, I guess. Oh, I, I do like the way that shield looks, so I'll take that. That is mine now. Here, let me... Let me try it just in case it works. See? There, there is a stealing hands. Okay, so I guess you're just gonna be crawling on the floor for a bit. Oh, wait, actually, I know how to fix that possibly. We could just... Also, did I just kill all of the guards of that city? Because if I did, that's very impressive. <laughs> At one time, just executed everyone, you know? Okay, so, let's see. Uh, comment down in the chat, how much gold do you think I'll get paid for this? Just a guess, and whoever gets closest... I don't know, there will be something. Of shout out, I guess, for the two people that are watching. Thank you. That bastard got exactly what he deserved. <laughs> okay. And See. I heard about Nelsine. You have more than fulfilled your part of the bargain. Please take this as payment and a symbol of my affection. I'll never forget you. Listen, lady. All I did was kill a couple of people for you. All right. So we got 1.2k. Uh, been guessed 1k. That is definitely that. That's twice worth what I usually get paid. So, graded potions are 15% more powerful. This is a trash ring. Good grief. Okay, so we'll just fast travel down here. So, I got four bounties that I get to turn in now and get paid for, so that's awesome. Time to head into the spooky scary spot. It's not even that spooky. I mean, the Thieves' Guild area is scarier than this place. I mean, good grief. Other than the door, of course. Because that door is weird, man. I mean, you see that door? Does that look like a normal door to you? No, it is not a normal door. Alright. Ah, oh, you're back. So, how went your first real contract? A bit more exciting than what Nazir's been offering, I'd wager? Of course, dear, of course. And from what my little ravens tell me, you handled yourself quite well. Now, is she I talking need your about how I killed all the guards? The whatever. Of a more personal nature. I don't like the way she's talking to me. Cicero, ever since he arrived, What's his behavior's need? been well, erratic would be an understatement. I do believe he is truly mad, but it's worse than that. He's taken to locking himself in the Night Mother's chamber and talking to someone in hushed but frantic tones. Who is he speaking with? What are they planning? I fear treachery. So you understand my fear. If Cicero's planning something and conspiring with one of our own... You know, earlier this stream, dangerous. I called it out that that guy was gonna die. And uh, I need you to steal into that chamber. Yeah. Eavesdrop on their meeting. It'll be no use clinging to the shadows. They'll see you for sure. No. You need a hiding place. Somewhere they'd never think to look. Like inside the Night Mother's coffin. Be that as it may, we have no other choice. You need to remain unseen. Now go. Before they meet. So we'll I'm hiding inside a Daedric, like a, a Daedric prince's coffin now. This is kind of messed up. Ten points for calling it. <laughs> nice pasta. <laughs> All right, so I'll head in right quick. Talk to this guy. So, you 
you reek of... Of course she is. I hear the mining business is extremely... I could do this all day. Here's your payment. Alright, so now we'll just get the rest of our contracts finished. Come. Here's your payment. You brother. Good. Your payment. For a job well done. Alright. Now for the night with the coffin one. Alright, so where do I have to head? Good luck. Hail and hearty. You give me too much credit. Yo, wait, what? How do I get there? Seems like a bad idea. Oh, I even have to pick the lock on it? Seriously? Okay, that this seems like a bad idea then. For sure. Called it. Even the Argonian and the Unchild. What about you? Hmm? Have you have you spoken to anyone? No. No, of course not. I do the talking, the stalking, the seeing, and the saying. I don't what discuss their personal personalities. Nothing. Not. I'm angry. No, never. Cicero understands. <laughs> Cicero always understands. And obeys. You will talk when you're ready, won't you? Won't you? Sweet night, mother. Oh, Cicero. Dear Cicero. Such a house. No. But he will never hear my voice, for he is not a listener. No, oh, but how can I defend you? How can I exert your will if you will not speak to anyone? Oh, but I will speak. I will speak I mean, to you. This is, this is weird. For you are the one. Awkwards. She spoke to you. More treachery. More trickery and deceit. You lie. The night mother speaks only to the listener. And there is no listener. She she said that. 
she said those words to you darkness rises when silence dies but those are the words the binding words written in the keeping tones signal so I would know mother's only way of talking to Cicero and it's true she's back our lady is back she has chosen a listener <laughs> she has chosen you <laughs> am I the patron for another day jerk no So that makes like five now. Why sit this? This ends now. Back away. Whatever you've been planning is over. Are you all right? I heard the commotion. Who was Cicero talking to? Where's your accomplice? Reveal yourself, traitor. I spoke only to the night mother. I spoke to the night mother, but she didn't speak to me. Oh no! She spoke only to him. To the what? The listener? What are you going on about? What is this lunacy? It's true! It's true! The Night Mother has spoken! The silence has been broken! The listener has been chosen! Can I sit down, please? When I heard Cicero screaming, I knew you'd been discovered. I feared the worst. Are you alright? <sighs> then what in Sicca's name is going on? <coughs> Cicero spoke to the Night Mother, but she spoke to you. Is this just more of the fool's rambling? What? So Cicero wasn't talking to anyone else. Just the Night Mother's body? And the Night Mother who, according to everything we know, will only speak to the person chosen as listener, just spoke. Right now. To you? By Sithis. And what did she say? Amand Motier? I have no idea who that is. But Valenrude, that I have heard of. And I know where it is. Hmm. No. No. Listen, I don't know what's going on here, but you take your orders from me. Are we clear on that? The Night Mother may have spoken to you, but I am still the leader of this family. I will not have my authority so easily dismissed. I... I need time to think about this. Go see us here. Do some work for him. I'll find you when I'm ready to discuss the matter further. Oh well, time to go kill some more fools, I guess. So Nazir is in the pit close to the spider, I think. Yeah, the spider pit's just like over there and then. So, hello, friend. Still here? What's the matter? I'll teach you how to use it effectively and keep you quick on your feet. Timing couldn't be better. As it turns out, I've got two new contracts. One Only two? Easy assignment, okay. And another that should prove quite a challenge. Hey! The first target is an orc bard named Lerboot. The other is a vampire by the name of Hearn. Oh, Happy no. hunting. Good luck. And try not to get yourself killed. Well, I certainly won't deny my involvement. <laughs> it's the part with the severed head I find most interesting. My compliments. And true, it was so easy. I feel a bit guilty. Once again, the sweet and sweet child and more trust. And remember, guys, that child is not a child. <laughs> They might have the body and voice of a child, but they're a vampire that's 300 years old. So, my character is also a vampire. Friend. Hello, Serana. 
Okay, so let's activate these, shall we? Alright, so now we need to... Okay, so where are we heading exactly? Morthal? Oh, dang it, I hate Morthal, man. Just a lame city in general, man. It's so tiny, and it's in like a... A swamp area, I guess? Like a... Snow swamp, maybe? If that makes sense? You guys will see what you guys will see what I'm talking about. Snow swamp. Stormblade, it's an honor. Morthal used to be a quiet place. Swamp fungus, so that just clarifies what I'm saying. Snow swamp. Weird, man. Death bells, those are used for making poison. Those are definitely useful. So I'll just grab a couple of those. Alright, so... This is gonna be a quick drop, but... One that I'm definitely gonna need to book it after I accomplish. What I'm there for. Alright, so... Dracula backwards is a loop part. Huh, okay. Is the line for my next performance What dad? <laughs> Come on. Don't a loop card. Plenty of room for everything. A loop card. <laughs> okay. So got to make sure there's no witnesses. I'm thinking of composing a song about you, Yoda. Would you prefer I proclaim your Help! Someone's being attacked! And now we'll just run. <laughs> Shot him right in the forehead as he was looking at me. Okay, heesh. See, this is this is why I said I definitely need to run afterwards. Because it's a 1.4k bounty. The second you pop someone off, so. Same with the guards. 1.4k. So. Oh, wait, actually, I just remember. It's a small city. I could easily just k kill the th four guards there and then just be done with the entire city. <laughs> Alright, so. Uh, that wants me to report back to Nazir. Okay. Time to do this uh, guy thing you kill assassination person thing. I don't know why this one was supposed to be a high value target or like a uh, a hard to kill one cuz it seems like it would be pretty easy. Also, check this out. Uh if you guys are uncomfortable with uh I don't know. I don't know how to say this. My character's about to be barely clothed. Sorry. <laughs> He's like just wearing the rag around his like waist, kind of like a bath towel, I guess. I don't know. He's just, you know, it's just kind of. He's wearing just barely anything, so I figured I might as well give a warning. I'm just using this ability so I can get across the water right quick. The Lady Stone. I think that gives you like a certain bonus or something for like prices. Like stuff costs less, I don't know. There's actually a sarcastic loading screen about it. It goes, The Lady Stone does not allow you to change your gender. Sorry, Tumblr. <laughs> I thought that was kind of funny. No, you're not getting away. Okay, so where's the other vampire? Shoot, wait, what the heck? Dragon! <laughs> oh shoot, this is a revered one. Okay. You guys are gonna get to see a pretty good boss fight right quick. 
Come on, come on. More for me back to normal, please. Hurry up. Okay. Yo, put the put the, 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 Okay, here we go, here we go. Okay. Um Yep, this is probably gonna go very bad very quickly. Okay, so where's this dragon at? I'm shooting at a dragon with dragon bone arrows. Shoot! That's what I hate about fighting dragons in urban areas, they always land on the rooftops. Thank you for proving my point, you stupid dragon! Okay, let's uh... Let's use Dragon Rend next time he gets close. I don't know why he's going so slow, but uh... I appreciate it. Did I hit him with that? Yes! so slow, but... Oh, there he goes. He's back to normal speed. <laughs> Where do you land at? Is he on the ground? Yeah, he is on the ground. Okay. And he's down. Alright. Got Daedric Gauntlets on him. That's kinda cool. Okay. What the heck? Do I, am I poisoned? Is that a disease? Alright, so yeah, that is a disease. So. Either that or it's a poison. We'll just figure out wh wh what happened. Did that pick it up? No, it is a poison then. Okay. Okay, so we should be good now. Yo, what the heck? It's not a disease or a poison. Alright, so... Did I do both of the kills? Yeah, okay. Sorry, I got sidetracked with the dragon. <laughs> So, uh, stream, how is everybody's day? Comment down below. The heck was that noise? What, what is this ash file? Yo! Wh why'd you get, like, raise a rabbit from the dead to fight? Good grief, that's kinda messed up. You, you got a rabbit to fight for us? to talk. Look, something is happening here. I'm not sure entirely what that something is, but, well, we need to find out. If the Night Mother really did give you an order to talk to a contact, we'd be mad to ignore it. And I think we'd both agree, Cicero's brought quite enough madness to this sanctuary. So go. Go to Volenrude. It's a crypt, pretty far to the northeast. Talk to this Dang. Armand Motier, and let's see where all this leads. Hmm? Okay. I'll do that quest, but first, Brother? I'm cashing in my bounties. Because I want my money. And if you, unless of course, one your payment as per the usual. Happy hunting. So, and now I 
go back now that the contracts are gone and ask for more. Brother. Well, aren't we the eager one? Sorry to disappoint, but there's nothing. Try me again later. <laughs> well, looks like I've killed everyone that's got a bounty on their head. Not sure whether that's an accomplishment <laughs> or what. But my first day and I've already gotten five kills? Five bounties? Yeah, five bounty kills completed, so that's pretty good. Five bounties on the first day there. I should become leader of this guild in no time also. Good to hear your day's going good, Bean. So let's take a quick peek at my current bounties on my head. The Rift, 10. Heil March, 1.4k. East March, 4k. My total lifetime bounty is 44,000. My largest bounty was 15,000. I've picked 67 locks, picked 4 pockets, 4 items stolen. Haven't been jailed yet. <laughs> I've only paid 12.1k of my bounties off. Um, stole 73 items, have 142 assault charges, 55 murders, and 12 trespasses. Yep. My character definitely is a wanted man. We got poachers. Okay. For once, I'm gonna be killing for justice. That's my first run in with poachers. Let's see what this person's got. Kinda lame. Okay. I, I think I grabbed something I didn't mean to. Was it a weapon? Did I grab a weapon? I don't use iron arrows. Maybe that was what I grabbed. Was it apparel? Let's see. Fur armor. Yeah, I didn't mean to grab that. I, yeah, I don't use fur armor. So, is my companion up here yet? Alright, they'll catch up to me later. Whatever. <laughs> and... We're almost up here, I think. This is where the contract is. The contract, the, uh... Quest. Valon Rude. Yeah, okay. Always check under the stairs. Like, look around, because you'll never know what extra loot or if Easter eggs and whatnot you'll find. So. Yeah. Now to the next area. Alright, so, right off the bat, we got a journal. I, I always collect 
the uh, journals and like the notes. Put you down right quick. Alright, next room. Why can't I move? Okay, there we go. Uh, pop through here. Oh wow, bloodstains all over the place. Drucker, Death Lord. Those guys are kind of dangerous. Just to be lying dead around here. <laughs> Normal Draugrs. Alright, so there was a pretty decent sized fight here. Not as big as the uh, Draugr fight that I uploaded By earlier. You've actually come. This dreadful black sacrament thing. It worked. Yes, um, so it would seem. Well, I won't waste your time. I would like to arrange a contract. Several, actually. I can hey. say, the work <laughs> I'm offering has more significance than anything your organization has experienced. Is that an Imperial in the back? Centuries. As I said, I want you to kill several people. You'll find the targets as well as their manners of elimination quite varied. I'm sure someone of your disposition would probably even find it enjoyable. Sure. You should know that these killings are but a means to an end, for they pave the way to the most important target. The real reason I'm seeking for the cutthroats in the bowels of this detestable crypt, for I seek the assassination of the Emperor. Wonderful. You don't know how happy I am to hear you say that. <laughs> Who am so I supposed to kill exactly? Day, so much planning and maneuvering. It's as if the very stars are finally aligned. But I digress. Here, take these to your uh, superior. Rexus, the items. The sealed I letter will explain everything that needs to be done. My dying the amulet is quite valuable. You can use it to pay for anything at all. Alright, so... Wait. Yo, I'm gonna keep that. That looks cool. I'm not selling that. That's, that's mine now. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Bouse, you're not getting your payment this time. <laughs> So, what do you guys think about this whole situation we got going? I, uh, this is whole situation thing where I'm working for like a assassin goddess, maybe I don't know. Good. All right. So, did you meet this motier? What did he want? You're joking. What's this? By Sithis, you're not joking. To kill the Emperor of Tamriel. The Dark Brotherhood hasn't done such a thing since the assassination of Pelagius. As a matter the of mad? Fact, huh. No one has dared assassinate an Emperor of Tamriel since the murder of Uriel Septim. And that was 200 years ago. No, she certainly wouldn't. And, for whatever reason, she chose to relay Motier's information to you. I don't know exactly what's going on here, if you're the listener, or this is some fluke, or what. But what we now have before us... <laughs> you're damn right we'll accept it. Well, but she's passionate. Day, the Dark Brotherhood will know a fear and respect we haven't seen in centuries. You think I'd abandon an opportunity to lead my family to glory? But this is all so much to take in. I need time to read the letter and figure out where we go from here. If you steal that amulet... Hmm. 
I'm thinking we need that amulet appraised. I want to know where it came from, how much it's worth, and if we can actually get away with selling it. And there's only one man who can give us what we need. Delvin Mallory. He's a fence, a private operator. Works in <laughs> Ratway in Rifton. Give me the letter. Bring Mallory the amulet. Find out everything you can. This is just disappointing. He'll offer a letter of credit. That's fine. Hello. Delvin Mallory and the Brotherhood have this name I can't pronounce. History. He can be trusted. All right. Oh, they didn't take the amulet. Hey, that's that's a plus. Right, so that's her private room. Uh, don't want to go in there and be a creep. Gotta go do the jab. All right, so let's go and do this job, I guess. Uh, in the right way. I'm I'm the leader of the thieves guild, so this shouldn't be anything new for me. Is selling off fenced goods. But do I have to sell the amulet? <laughs> I just want to keep it. Because I could pay th for the expenses myself. Normally, man. And into the racket flag and we go. But yeah, the uh, whole Thieves Guild base is set up in the sewers under Riften, so. Sorry, lad. I've got important things to do. We'll speak another time. <sighs> Alright, now we'll go in and sell off a bit of fenced goods. My amulet. Where oh where did you get this? No, don't answer. I don't want to know. This is an amulet of the Emperor's Elder Council. Especially oh. for each member. We have a small fortune. Ain't something you give up lightly. Look, it ain't my business to tell the Dark Brotherhood its business. But if you killed a member of the Elder Council, you better believe. Buy it. This. An Elder Council amulet? Oh yes. Oh yes indeed. Oh wait, just one moment. Here is a letter of credit, usable by Astrid only, for any service or item I can provide. As per our standard arrangement, you bring that back to your lovely mistress. With my regards. Look at the word. Alright, now I'm going to try to buy this off of him. I, dang it, okay, I can't. Maybe I can... She's the lady that sells everything, so... Maybe I'll be able to buy it off of her? Hopefully? She's literally got someone's clothes, okay. Right, some for did that lady just insult me? I'm literally her boss. What the heck? Not even behind my back either. Just right in front of me. Okay. Well, she is fired. Yes. Let's get back to this.
let's hop on. Alright. Hey Ben, if you want to, you can, uh, go ahead and hop on PlayStation. We'll just, like, talk while the stream's well, going, if you want. Back. Well, what did Mallory have to say? Is the amulet authentic? The Elder Council? Oh, now that explains quite a bit. Motier, you naughty, naughty boy. Hiring the Dark Brotherhood to help you rise beyond your station. Delicious. Was Mallory willing to buy the amulet? The heck? Splendid. Then we're ready to begin. Or, more specifically, you're ready to begin. Yep, After that's what I figured. You're the one the Night Mother spoke to. Now then, I hope you have something nice to wear, because you're going to a wedding. What? Well, more like the public reception. It should be a lovely affair. <sighs> You'll mingle with the guests, eat some cake, stab the bride. Oh, yes. You've got to kill the bride at her wedding. And they say romance is dead. <sighs> her name is Vittoria Vici. She oversees the East Empire Company's business holdings in South Yes! I finally get to kill that person. City, at the Temple of the Divines. Yo, the East Empire Company cost me, causes me so much crap, especially when I do these skill jobs. It's annoying. As is the wedding custom. <laughs> she does that, and I promise you a significant bonus. Now go, and give my best to the bride. All right, so I'm gonna need some good clothes. I know exactly where to go. I have some extra fine clothes back at my house here at the Lakeview. I knew I'd have to wear a disguise for some jobs, so I just keep the extra uh, clothes just in the chest. Okay, that that's a good loading screen right there. <laughs> Alright, so there's no enemies right here. Okay, that's good. We'll head on inside. <laughs> Get the good clothes and kill some scrubs. Or a scrub. If the guards get in my way, they'll die too. This is an ode to Skyrim's truest sons and daughters, the Stormcloaks. I do still have the stuff here, right? Shoot. <laughs> oh, thank goodness. Okay. Yes, you are, Ben. Just so you know, uh, Baka in in uh Japanese means idiot. Okay, so we'll throw the fine clothes on. <laughs> <laughs> we'll drive out the empire from this land that we own. With our blood and our steel, we will take back our home. All hail to Ofrin, you are the High King. In your great honor, we drink and we sing. We're the children of Skyrim, and we fight all our lives. Southern guard beckons, every one of us dies. But this land is ours, and we'll see it wiped clean of the scourge that has sullied our hopes and our I should probably do three things. Unequip the arrows off my back, take the katana. Wait, actually I'm gonna want to have the katana equipped. In your 
Okay. We're definitely gonna need some shoes that aren't. Okay, so... We don't want to go barefoot, but we definitely don't want to wear... Like, that armor. So what we'll do is we'll grab some boots. Uh, nah, I'll just make some real quick. Do I want? No, that doesn't look good. Uh, belted? Nah. No. That's that's pretty good. I'll make that. You're home. Let's play a game. The heck. Alright, yeah. Those boots look decent. I'll wear those. <laughs> Let's do this. Alright, so... Yeah, don't mind the sword scabbard! It's, uh, it's, it's for business. I am an undercover so agent. Okay. So, wait a second. That icon is, like, right next to my house. Does that mean that the... Wait. Um, I really hope it's just a col... It's in the college courtyard right next to my house. Because if, it, if it's in my house... <laughs> okay, I like, I like that uh, little thing it threw there. If you use a shield, you're probably a wuss. Yeah, that's why I dual wield swords and don't use shields, man. Alright, so it's not where I thought it was. It's farther up this way. That's, that's okay. Just if it was at my house, it would be a lot easier. So, here's we'll, where we'll do some. I'm so glad that Dorian and I are like you know the reception. Land. That no, way, the entire people. city can share in the You're from Cyrodiil. You know nothing about us. Nothing. Vittoria did pretty well for herself Enough. marrying that as I know those not a bad looking fellow. Stormcloaks refuse to submit to imperial authority. Such sedition behavior. Why, it's treason. If I want my bonus, I wait until she addresses everyone. Against them. Wasn't that treason? Against the Dominion? Huh? Why, that's not the same thing at all. Alright, so we'll go up and get a good view from above and hit her with a bow and arrow. Now that I think this is actually a pretty good strat. singing down there, like a cappella. What the heck? Alright, so we'll... Okay. Yo, this is just, like... Uh, this is gonna be pretty cool. I, I, at least I think it would be. Victoria, no! You have committed crimes against Skyrim and their... Has been murdered. 
Straight up committed murder <laughs> and got away with it just by going, I'm your superior, back off, <laughs> basically. That, that's... yep. <laughs> this is one of those scenarios where I want to speak what's on my mind right now, but I'm definitely get, gonna get my entire channel down, taken down if I do mention it. Alright, time to loot her right quick. What the heck kind of outfit is this for a wedding? I will take the wreath and that just because it looks good and it's probably worth a decent amount. Yeah, let's just take a quick look here. Uh, it's only. <laughs> I wonder why. <laughs> okay. Uh, it's, li it's literally just a reskin of the fine clothes. Literally just a. Yeah, it's just a reskin. Whatever, man. That's pretty lame. Especially for the quote unquote high queen. Hmm? Okay. Report back to Astrid. Inside we go. Okay, so dead queen. Literally, I'm surprised. I only got 1.4k bounty for killing the high queen. <laughs> the news is everywhere. Vittoria Vici, the emperor's cousin, butchered at her own wedding. Well. It wasn't even a butcher. I literally just shot an arrow. With Vici's murder, you've started us down a path the Dark Brotherhood hasn't traveled in centuries. The assassination of an emperor. And now your reward. A unique spell to summon a legend of the Dark Brotherhood. His soul serves us now in death, as his body once did in life. Ah, and of course, a bonus for killing Vici while she addressed her guests as instructed. Go, simple and pure. Spend it as you will. Now then, time to proceed to the next stage of the plan. Go and speak with Gabriella. She's been helping me arrange your next contract. Give me my stuff first, lady. Summon spectral assassin added. Alright. Oh. Okay, so they gave me the spell straight out instead of like the spell tome. Is it a power? Alright. Wait, do I have to talk to the little girl? No, okay. I shall be back shortly. Just gonna be back in probably one minute or less. Stream, I'm back. Dear brother, I've been waiting for you. Your next contract awaits, as I'm sure Astrid indicated. With the Emperor's arrival in Skyrim now a certainty, his security service, the police, will need to begin its preparations immediately. 
Security is being handled by a Commander Morrow. Astrid and I have devised a plan to break the man, and in doing so, cripple the Emperor's protection. You are to slay the Commander's son, Gaius Morrow. Once he is dead, plant false evidence on his body, implicating him in a plot to kill the Emperor. <coughs> he is set to leave the Penitus Oculatus outpost at Dragon Bridge and inspect the security of each city in Skyrim. Go there now. Observe Gaius Morrow's departure and follow him. Waylay him in one of the cities and send his soul to Sippus. Once he's dead, plant the incriminating letter on his body and let fate take care of the rest. Oh, and one final thing. To earn your bonus, do not kill Gaius Morrow in Dragonbridge or on the road. Kill him in one of the other major cities he'll be visiting. There, the body will be discovered quickly, as will okay. the letter implicating Gaius Morrow in the plot to assassinate the Emperor. Do that, and Astrid has authorized me to grant you a rather unique bonus. It is a special token to be given to Olava the Feeble in Whiterun. Olava is an old and dear friend, and a powerful seer. The token entitles you to a reading of your future. It's an opportunity one should not pass up. <laughs> oh my word. Okay. You know, I could just steal his travel schedule, or I could do this with style. And I think I'm gonna do this with style, and just kind of follow him around. But like, shadow him, you know what I mean? So just follow him from a distance. Speaking of the East Empire, I actually have a pendant of them right here that I enchanted for some shock resistance, sorry, magic resistance. Uh, I personally really hate the East Empire because of all the crap that I had to do for the um, Thieves Guild just to kind of get rid of them a little bit. Okay, I'm going to take that book because that's a book on a Daedric Prince. Definitely going to need that. Okay, so now we'll just... Alright, so I'm not supposed to kill him in Dragon Bridge or on the road. Alright, and we're gonna... If that doesn't get... <laughs> yeah, at least I don't have to get worry about getting demonetized, because I'm not monetized in the first place. <laughs> So fine. I know you will. All the same. Remember everything I said. I'm going to steal the travel schedule first. I'm very certain so. you wandered into the wrong building, friend. You must be lost. Mourned us. Solitude at the Empire's Tower. Avon is down the road a piece. Is there a way I can go invisible? Possibly, maybe, hopefully. Anything at all? <laughs> And now, since I can't be seen, hey, hands off! Goodbye. By the order of the yard. Stop right there. Wait, I'm invisible. How do you see me? If you just watch yourself. Next time, I might not be so lenient. Hey, that was cool. I only had a one gold bounty, so I was just able to persuade him. All right, so wait until he's at a city. Okay, wait, what? It said I was invisible. Yeah, vampire's invisible and has improved night vision for 180 seconds. What do you mean? Oh, wait, this is a spell that I cast? Okay. I might want to equip the katana in my right hand 
since I have a bounty on my head. Actually, what the heck? Why am I even gonna do that? I don't need to summon him. I do want that armor. Definitely want that armor. Because that's not normal Imperial armor. Here, we'll just... We'll just wait a while for him to get gone. Okay, wait. I need to check this travel schedule again. To see what the close closest time was. Mourned us, mourned us evening, turned us. Alright, so I need to get to solitude at the. I'm sorry, what? Dang it! Alright, well, at least you guys get to see what the Dawn Guard look like in action. Okay. No, you don't. Okay, so. Uh, Dawn Guard heavy armor? That's. So, as you guys can see, these guys are like super anti vampire because th all their weapons do extra damage to vampires and whatnot. <coughs> so, now we'll pull this guy's inventory up, see what he's got. Nothing of value. Nothing of value again. Alright. Uh, now, let's head off to. What the heck? This guy's gone far. Alright, we're going into Riften. Assassination. Shall be... I don't know. Definitely gonna happen. Okay, so... A reader here will put it back and cover the boat sheath. It's super handy because you definitely don't have another 1.2k heroes. Fair enough. They can make all your problems with the guards go away, but it'll cost you. What do you say? Done. Now move along before you get me in trouble. Okay. I should be good for a while then. He's gonna regret letting me pay him off. About to be a major, uh political figure gonna get assassinated in you mean? What is this place? A bar? Yeah, the BM bar, but it's an N slash bar. Keep back, citizen. I have important business I must attend to. Until next time. You know what? I I, I feel like being a little bit generous, so I'm gonna give him a quick death. Oh! He's not one that can die so easily. <laughs> You're gonna regret this. Alright. Now that he's dead, thanks for the letter. I'll just take your clothes. And I'm gone. Goodbye. I don't have that armor set. Now I do. You know what? I'm curious about this spectral assassin thing. So, YOLO! Are you gonna get a fight? Yeah, this guy's lame. Does nothing. No wonder he died. you get me in trouble. Okay. This is actually some pretty good light armor. If I'm being real with you guys. Yeah, this is straight up almost as good as the assassin armor. 
I mean, it's not good enough for me to actually wear in combat, but it, it's going, it's going on a mannequin on the trophy wall, man. Going on the trophy wall. I think I'll replace the Imperial Captain set with this armor. Where'd you come from? Yeah. Oh, yeah, I need to put the letter on that guy's corpse. Shoot! Okay. Uh, I almost screwed that assignment up pretty bad. My question is, where would this letter be stored? Seeing as how he's now in his underwear? Anyone else got an idea? Anyone? Am I just gonna slide it in his underwear or some crap? Like, what the heck? Where am I gonna put this? Yo, what the heck? Okay, you know what? Um... I don't have any business with you, so get out of my face. Oh. What happened? Oh. Ours is to smile at your passing, my friend. You have some nerve coming back here after what you did to Kirava. Listen, man, I got you your wedding ring. Be Welcome quiet. to the Bee and Barb, my lord. If I can interest you in one of our special. I don't have any business with you. So That's a lot of guards. <laughs> right on the door. <laughs> I don't have any business with you. Alright. Time to dip. So. We framed him after we killed him and stripped him down to his underwear. Out of my face. Yep. That's uh <laughs> definitely something. What's up with the super baggy clothes? Yes, I know. As does Astrid. You have done well and have earned both your reward and a bonus, as I have mentioned. But you should know that we have a more pressing matter to deal with. It's Cicero. There's been an incident. You should proceed into the sanctuary. I'll let Astrid explain. Does he have a time limit? Until he's defeated. Okay. <sighs> Let the elixir do its work. You'll feel better shortly. Ah, thank you, dear. You are most kind. Truly, a sanctuary to call home. Damn it! This never should have happened. We knew better. We knew better, and still we let our guards down. Ugh. I'll admit, even I'm having a hard time disagreeing with you. Marrow is dead, I know. But we've got bigger problems right now. Marrow? The fool went absolutely berserk. He wounded Gizara, tried to kill me, and then he fled. I knew that lunatic couldn't be trusted. Oh, it's true, I'm afraid. Cicero was a little whirlwind. Slashing this way and that, it, it would have been funny. Or trying to murder us all. And don't forget the ranting of Raven. About the Night Mother, how she was the true leader of the Dark Brotherhood. And Astrid was just a pretender. Look, we've got to deal with this situation. You've got to deal with this situation. 
I want you to find that miserable little fool and end his life. But first, find my husband. Make sure he's all right. After the attack, Onbjorn flew into a rage. When Cicero left, Onbjorn went after him. They disappeared into the wild. Search Cicero's room. Maybe there's something in there that sheds some light on where he might have gone. Let me know the minute you find something. I've got to see to Vizara and calm everyone down. Left it by a fool. Who's the fool now, hmm? Hush, Vizara. You were very brave. Ask him. It's so weird having, like, a child. <laughs> like, eh, it's just weird, man. Like, as an assassin, like a highly trained one at that. Alright, so we got copies of his journal. The man knew how to write. Hmm. How many the copies does this guy have? Good position within the Dark Brotherhood. Ask yourself. Do you trust the wisdom of Our Lady? <sighs> Is there a way I can help someone have... No? Okay. Bad stream stuff, YouTube and Twitchery. Spider bit bug. Uh, uninstall life. found something? Good, good. Does it say where he may be headed? This is weird, man. The Dawnstar Sanctuary? Whatever for. Never mind, it doesn't matter. You need to leave. Now. Every moment counts. So I want you to take my horse. Not okay with that. Oh, I get a horse. You'll find him outside by the school. There's a pool? just say he's one of us. Find on Bjorn. Make sure your horse is a dark right. assassin. And then send that jester's twisted little soul to the void in as many pieces as possible. Damnable jester. Okay. Okay, let's do this. Uh, I don't understand. Shit, I would like to see you try streaming. Thank you, especially when I don't have any equipment and I literally have a disease. It's not great for my skin, if you know what I mean. The heck is this? Yo, what? The heck? Yo, this horse is actually fast, as opposed to normal ones. Also laggy. Probably because he's fast. Okay. Yo, this thing is laggy. <laughs> But so fast. I can't complain. It's worth. Well then. It would appear as if I'm at a crossroads. Can he swim? The horse can swim. Okay. What quality is the stream at right now? 720p? Okay, that's pretty good. Uh, I don't have amazing Wi-Fi. I can't get really good Wi-Fi in the small town I'm in. So, I can't stream at uh, 1080p. I can do 720p. So... Okay. Uh, spider bit. It was... Uh, just trying to get reactions. Alright, so you're a troll. Got it. <laughs> Might not be cancerous as, as, the, as a bunch of like the people that tune into streams just to say they're bad and stuff, but trolls are still a little bit cancer. All right. So, oh well, just sticking up for people. Yeah, thank you, Peter McCool and Bean, 
for being nice. Alright, so back to the actual stream. Well, technically this is the stream. Interacting with the fans is part of it, you know? Okay, so let's... Get back to the gameplay is what I probably should have said. What the heck? That was a short fall. How did I die? Oh, I didn't. I fell off the horse, though. Is, uh... Are, are you guys gonna be... Are they gonna be... They're probably gonna be mad about me getting Shadow Mirror killed, but honestly, <laughs> I don't care. The leader is a fake anyways, so... I should be very scared about incurring the wrath of a fake. Ah, rip. Yep, that the demon horse is dead. Right, wait, is there was there actually a road? Okay, no, that just led into the cave. I was about to say if there was a road that I just didn't see <laughs> and I killed the demon horse for no reason. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that would have been bad, man. Alright, so, oh, they're right outside. I could have just fast traveled. Are you kidding me? Okay, whatever. So, uh. Peter McCool and uh, Spider Bit the Pug. How. Oh my gosh, voice cracks. Sorry, guys. Uh, so, how is everyone's day currently? Comment down below. Alright, so now I'll respond to and whatnot. Do, don't I have a bounty on my head here? Maybe, I don't know. <coughs> Hello, small child. Oh, they're dead. Oh, my pa that was got a depressing. Sailor. Took me with him on his last trip. After he got sick, Hi, that's good. they put us off here and left without us. He died a few days later. I've tried to make do since then, but it's been hard. I would adopt him, but I can only have two kids adopted at the same time, so. I mean, I have the extra beds. I'm watching from Ireland, so it's night right now. Oh, okay. That's cool. Uh, I actually am from Irish and Scottish heritage, so. I'm like half Irish, I think. Yeah, roughly half Irish. It's not exactly like 50%. It's, it is like from mid to, like, it's from mid 40s to high uh, 50s, so. Should have figured Astrid would send you. Ugh, what gave it away? <laughs> yeah, gotta admit that little jester's good with that butter knife. But don't worry, I gave as good as I got. There, and Bean is from Scottish heritage. Sanctuary, by the looks of it, I would have followed him, but I don't know the phrase. I am not a ginger. I have a soul. All right, you convinced me. Doubt I'd be much good to you anyway. The little fop cut me pretty deep, but I slashed him good. Pretty sure I severed an artery. Don't know what you're gonna find in there, but you can probably just follow the blood. Neither is Flame. Flame is a dirty blonde. And I'm not saying that as in, like, he's like a filthy blonde, like, his hair. What is life's greatest illusion? Well then. Innocence is life's greatest illusion. Wow, that is deep, dude. That is... <laughs> hmm. I mean, they're not wrong. Well, that, that scared me.
Yo, <laughs> that was close. Uh, Ben, just go ahead and hop on. I'll, I'll just, like, well, I'll just talk to you while the stream's going on. Yo, I swear that guy's on some form of drug. <laughs> I'm not sure what yet, but he's definitely on something. Like, my guess is... My guess is he had three too many skumas. Which, if you guys aren't familiar, skuma is an alcohol in this game. Like a hard liquor, almost. this. Dang it, door's barred. Okay. Don't know how I'm getting blood on my swords from fighting, from fighting ghosts, but hey, what else? Alright. Three times six, maybe? What? Ah, uh, you go. Alright. Uh, I mean, glad if you're having a good time, man. I'm just... What the heck? What, what is this thing? This... What... What the witchcraft created this monstrosity? It's a form of troll. Okay. Hey! I just killed Spider-Bet. Gross. Fair enough. I don't think they had it back then, though. I would say, let's keep this family friendly, but A, I already put the warning at the beginning of the stream that this wouldn't be family friendly. These guys are easy, good grief. Only thing I, that's really hurt me was, uh, well, not even that. I just, my stamina. My question is, how can we still hear this guy? swords have lifesteal. Um, the left blade does. The one that's not the katana. The katana has a shock enchantment on it. For 20 damage, I think? Yeah, 20. You know, honestly, I would let him live, but he killed the werewolf dude, and I like werewolves. I can take his outfit? Okay, you know what, why not? Ah, okay, yeah. I have a scroll of mayhem, holy ebony war axe, what the heck? Fine, I'll take it, why not? Alright, stream one second here. I'm gonna be creating a chat and inviting Flame in. Actually, I already have the chat made up. All I have to do is invite him now. Alright, let's get him in here. Honestly, I'm pretty happy with this stream. Uh, first stream back, and I've got a, 
I've gotten a few viewers that came in and out, you know? I'm happy with it. Long time of inactivity, got Skyrim. First stream back out of a couple of years, you know? What more could I ask for? <laughs> when I'm the small of a YouTuber, that is, you know? Hello. Hey. Good to hear your voice again, friend. Uh, just so you know, um, Peter McCool, uh, Flame and I go way back, dude. I've known this guy for how many years now? 10? 11? Yeah, 11. Yeah, 11 years now. So. This is my boy. <laughs> I could ride my bike himself if I needed to. Yeah, he literally le lives like, uh, 5, 10 minutes away? Maximum did, of 10 minutes. Did I just go in a giant loop? Yes, I did. Okay, good for me, man. <laughs> I would say it helps me drag the video out to 10 minutes, but hey, this is a live stream. <laughs> it's been going on for how many? Two hours. Two hours. two hours, yeah. Literally two hours and 50. Sorry, now, now it's two hours. It was one hour, 59 minutes, and 57 seconds when I started saying that. Alright, let's do this. Okay. So, yeah, dude, I love Skyrim. This is awesome. So, yeah, I stream one second, I'm a, alright, Ben? Yeah. Actually, actually, no, let's let Peter decide this, okay, soup, pizza, or Chex Mix? Well, you have a snack and two foods. <laughs> Cho choose which yep. one? I'll let- I'll let the rando choose. Just cause Ben, you know my personality, you just pick the one I enjoy the most. I- I want him to guess. What's my YouTube channel? His username on PlayStation, which is Flamo995. Just uh, click on any time he's commented, and it'll just take you straight to his channel. He's got like two or three vids up. No, no, no I've privated him. You private him? Yeah, they were kind of cringy, yeah. to be honest. Sorry. Kind of hard. There's just one more target before we strike out the Emperor. Have you by chance heard of the gourmet? The gourmet. It's become quite a phenomenon. What the heck? Yeah, the you know, you should still listen. You should have done, um, Skyrim and, um, Steal his writ of VR. And assume the role Yo, no, I- VR's headset is too expensive. It's like 200 bucks. I don't- I don't have that money. Well, I have a birthday gift from me. Okay. <laughs> I completed the cure for madness. Okay. So... What is it? So what is the cure for madness then? Um, me. <laughs> Do you be the cause of madness? <laughs> Fair enough. Fair enough. So did you notice that I saw that lady's wedding dress? <laughs> yeah, I was watching the entire time. Okay. Yo, is this guy gonna be okay? I don't know. He's got like blood stains at his feet. I'm dealing with Cicero, eh? Now let's get down to business. Astra told you about the gourmet, I hope. Quite I don't, yeah, I think the um, other person left. Yeah, probably to go check out your channel out or whatever. Is a he. Could be a woman for all we know. Don't be so petulant. Alright, Ben, which one? Soup, what? Chex Mix, or pizza? It's a coffee. The gourmet's cool. Pizza. Okay. Any coffee. Wait, wait, real question. Are you really that hungry? Seems to be a message from the gourmet. Oh, too late. I'm already eating the pizza. Ah. Yeah. What type of pizza is it? Meat lovers. Don't say. Okay. I was like, don't say supreme or Hawaiian. Oh, you're still here. Okay. 
I'll do it. Please don't be dead. <laughs> ah, third viewer. It's been quite a boom looking like he died. No one ever suspects the game. Lag. When you asked that question, did it really matter what I picked because you had the pizza? Oh no. Uh, I had the pizza and the Chex Mix right next to each other, and then the soup was in the fridge right behind me. Yeah, I, yeah. I'm just gonna walk over just to get some of that pizza, but it's probably gonna be gone by the time I, like I just ate the last slice, sorry. Yeah, exactly. Go. It's a Luigi's pizza. Are they good? I haven't had any yet. Mm-hmm. Amazing. Did you hear that we're gonna get Starbucks? Really? Yeah. Like next year. Oh, I was about to, I thought you meant like soon. That's still Starbucks. Mm. I was about to say, hey, now my mom can even be even more basic. I'm kidding. <laughs> Dang. Savage. I'm pretty sure I have a bounty in the city of like three grand. I don't know why I'm not getting like attacked what it right was now. What's the Dawn place? Dawn Guard? Dawn Star? Yes, yes, for the Whatever it's called. I think you can see the name wherever you're at. I am at Mark Arth right now. Weird name. What age am I? I am 14. Who are you? What do you want? The my door's really loud. Never. I don't know what mm -hmm. led you here, but nothing will betray my trust. Violet is so great. I'm in my kitchen. The Dark Brotherhood? Now, now, wait a minute. Not get hasty. I'm sorry my friend wouldn't want me to endanger my own life, right? Look, his name is Balagor Cronolo. He's an orc. The gourmet's an orc. He's staying at the Nightgate Inn. That's all I know. Now, okay. Now you'll let me get there, too. All right, cool. Okay, all right. Wonderful. You're welcome. 
just be on my way then. Time to go wreck this gourmet chef nerd. Oh no! Oh, I thought I just cheated that axe out. <laughs> he he hit me in the back though. Yeah, I'm gonna be. I'm gonna finish this quest and then I'm gonna cut the stream. Quick quick question. You said you're gonna be back after the, you got from the beach. Like you're gonna be back for good. What's up with that, man? Now you gotta go again. I right, quick question. Will you tell me after the stream's over what you're doing? Okay. Yeah, we can't get your. We can't put your agenda life, because then you know personal life and all that. Well, I mean we could, but consent that dress like the old channel <laughs> oh my gosh I'm pretty sure Is that even still a channel I think I deleted I'm it I'm gonna check I'm gonna check <laughs> just don't say the name of it okay <laughs> I don't think I don't see it. Alright, uh, that's good. <laughs> yeah, uh, I should have put the channel on private, like the entire channel. Oh, wait, I'm I'm trying to remember if I had Austin as a moderator of my channel. Oh gosh, I do not. It be really bad. <laughs> yeah, good. Easily. Hey, you can make me a moderator. Don't know how. <laughs> you just click on my name. Okay. Hacky sack with a. Never mind. I get to. Time out Austin whenever he gets here. Yeah, <laughs> just time out him. Yo, he was the, the first person that tuned into the stream. He popped in and started spamming high immediately. He spammed yeah, know, high in chat six times. Um, I would I would have came, but I was watching a video and it was almost over. And okay. I was like, Ugh. I shot you a text. Yeah, I know, I got it. That's where I, at the beginning I ran into a wall, <laughs> literally. It just in real life, full sprint, the <laughs> text, just right into a wall. Oh hey, more cultists got more cultists got sent after me. That's that's always fun. Always fun, you know. Cultists are the best, you know. Probably should have said that. It was sarcastic, and everyone that has half yeah. of a brain can detect that. Well, maybe they don't have a brain. Maybe they have one third of a brain. Like the Wall Street Journal. You're going too far. Hashtag down, free sorry. PewDiePie. <laughs> He's not in jail. I just, I just wanted to say that. Hashtag He's got too much controversy know. around him. Laugh. Loa. Meme review. Dude, I don't. I didn't even watch PewDiePie's Detroit Become Human video. I just hate that game. <laughs> it's just so weird. Don't you agree? Yeah. I, there's another one of those instances where I've never watched any of Logan or Jake Paul sing. I just know the songs because somebody has a certain name of Kenneth. No. James is the one that... No, James that blasts too. Jake Paul that songs. That's... That is... Too, that's too I, awesome. I used to be... A fan of Logan Paul. Used to be. And then the whole Suicide Forest thing happened, and I'm like, nope. 
I I forgot about that. To be he honest. just left at a dead guy. <laughs> nope. I didn't even. I forgot about that. Hmm. That was back in the time where you actually were at school. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Did I go? Nope. <clears throat> Not my fault. I got a disease now. I mean, it could have been your fault. Actually, no, it's my I mom's think, fault. It's genetic. I, 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 I know why. I know why. Because you went to school. No, dude, I'm telling you, like, the disease I have is straight up genetic. Like, I got that's, it from my mom. She had it when she was a kid. That's it, pretty it, nice. it just wasn't a diagnosed. Like, it wasn't something that they could diagnose yet, because they didn't know what it was. They just chucked nice. it up to bad allergies. You basically left the same time two years in a row. Okay. And now we're diving too deep into personal life. I'm sure I can't be of help. I'm just okay. Let's see. Do you mind if I ask what disease? Uh, it's something really stupidly long. Uh, yeah, but I basically I the, abbrevi the, the abbreviation of it is uh POTS syndrome. That's not what you told me, but okay. Um, no, they changed the diagnosis because of the symptoms and stuff. They got a more professional doctor on it. Because the uh treatment for gastroparesis wasn't working. So they decided to test me for POTS and they got a professional person that's had a bunch of people with POTS. That's his patients. And uh yeah. I mean, it's an actual thing. Mm -hmm. Hey, Mom. What's the full name of, uh, POTS? Postural Syndrome. Postural... Yeah, I'm reading it. Orthal Tachycardic... Or a, yeah. And then... Tachycardic Syndrome. Yeah. Yeah. That... Yeah. <coughs> it's very common. No, actually. It's not. Yeah, it is. That common. More than... 200,000 cases a year, U.S. Hmm. Well, then I've been misinformed. Google, baby. I'm, uh, dragging a body, currently. Yeah, I'm not on the stream right now, so... Well, you should be. I'm sorry, I was trying to tell you what it was, and you were just like... I'm dragging her body, yeah, 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 yeah. I'm hoping there's a hiding spot where I can put this. <laughs> Cause this is gonna be I'm awkward just... if someone walks in and sees me just dragging <laughs> a just guy's like... body. <laughs> it's like, it's not what it seems like. He's just passed out. He's and not he's... dead, he's just and unconscious. He's, he's passed out and in a coma, yeah. Yeah. Where would a good what hiding spot be? On somebody's head. It's so dark I can barely see it. I, th I think I put it. I think I put it in a good spot. I can barely see it because my brightness on my phone is really down. I could just like, yo, what if I just threw his corpse on the bed? <laughs> <laughs> it's like, it's like. Uh, I mean, if somebody walks into you you're in, while you're doing it, you're just like, Did you do this? No, I was just seeing um, if he had any lead on this, but I meant what? I was just stealing his right of passing what? Yeah, Don't know how that counted. Wait, what? Just, just, just look at what just happened on stream. I, I told you I can't. <laughs> Why? It's so dark. Turn your brightness up, you scrub. And it doesn't help that I'm right next to a window. That I'm too lazy to close the blinds. <laughs> sunlight. Speaking of sunlight, can I? <laughs> I don't need any. I'm fine. <laughs> <laughs> now don't tell yourself that. 
That's what I've been telling myself for this past year. Alright, place your bets. Is the spooky ghost guy still following me around? Yes or no? Yes. Alright. And you are... And if... And if dumb. I'm wrong, just summon on me. Oh. <laughs> I didn't even say if you're wrong, or it's dumb. <laughs> I took the SAT already. So did you. <laughs> mm hmm But did you miss zero questions on science? No, I missed zero questions on the history. My history wasn't even that hard. And the I know, right? And then the next year so I missed one question in the science. It seems a certain orc has disappeared. Oh, I just popped my rubber band. That hurt my fingers. That was a rubber band that I used for um the shooting and you know the 100 resupplies. Splendid. Mm -hmm. Ah. And word has come in from Mark. Rest in peace to rubber band. You will never be remembered. <laughs> <laughs> and I have a second one. <laughs> I can't pop that one because I don't have any more. I see that now. Maybe we all were. Here's your payment. Echo. A little something else. Jack. Is it really echoey? Yeah, it is echoey. Night well, something fingers. band? What? Nightweaver's Band? Okay, this isn't even special. This is just a silver and amethyst ring. This is lame. Two very cheap materials. <laughs> or at least in Skyrim. Silver IRL is expensive. And amethyst really isn't. Yeah, no. I, dude, you and I got, got like a... <clears throat> giant I amethyst really chunk nice. for like five bucks. I have a really nice, like, really cool geode that was really expensive. Mm -hmm. Okay, this is really weird, because I'm watching your stream on the PlayStation, and I can hear everything. Mm-hmm. Oh, I have the utmost faith in your success, believe me. So let's begin. Go now to Castle Dower in Solitude. Present the Gourmet's writ of passage to the officer in charge. If anybody's watching, favorite pizza. I'm sure you remember him. Meat lovers. You gain unrestricted access to the kitchens, and then the emperor. You're posing as a chef, so you'll be able to poison his meal. Dang it, I didn't mean to look there. Okay. Here, take this. It's called What are you looking at? All it takes is one I was just moving my crosshair around, like I was looking at where the name is, and I'm and I just moved it down, <laughs> and I like saw the thighs, and I'm like, and I just thought to myself, why is she so thick? Margarita? Is that a thing special? Like Margaritaville? What is Margarita Pizza? Represent us well. Uh, is that where you just take a margarita and pour it on pizza? Two, the really good thing to have this known as Google. Triggered. Alright, stream, after I uh, do this little quest thingy here, uh, Ben and I are just gonna hang out and catch up. Cheese. He likes cheese pizza. Oh. I, yeah, that's... I mean, it's good. Typically... Neopol... <laughs> Sorry, it's not said joke. Hmm. I feel like I've had that pizza before. Margarita pizza? I feel like it. But I've, I like barbecue pizza. Barbecue chicken pizza. It's pretty nice. Stop right there. The tower is off limits until further notice. Is that a wolf? A what? Is that a house of wolf? <coughs> wolf. No. Wolf. Guessing it. The gourmet. I 
I'm sorry. I didn't realize. We had no idea who to expect. Oh, there was a banner. That said that, that was a wolf. But please, don't let me proceed to the kitchen straight away. Yana, okay. Castle Chef, I've been eagerly awaiting your arrival. Let me inside, dang it. Okay, you know what? Just because I feel like being that guy, I'm going to wear his son's outfit in front of him. That guy. <laughs> yeah, I, I killed your son. Will be overjoyed I killed your son and now I'm wearing his clothes. <laughs> There's a 10 second latency. Okay. Alright, let's see here. I'm carrying one pound too many. What no. do I not need? Uh, that banana that you picked up. Wait, banana? I don't know. I'm just oh wait, I have tw I have twenty bottles of alcohol on me. I can drop that. Uh, chug, 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 chug. You got it. No, you just left him on the floor. No. Oh no, you picked him back whoa, up. Whoa, whoa, Asifer, I don't feel so good. <laughs> oh. You're really slow. I told you people, our stocks are fine. Now, the gourmet? He just walked into a wall. Oh, finally. When I heard the gourmet was being brought in to cook for the Emperor, <coughs> I could hardly believe it. It's just... Oh well, it's just... I never imagined the gourmet was a Khajiit. You know, because of Jerk, that's racist. For getting hair in the I can't even hear any of it, so get me. Oh. Actually, you're not. Wearing a chef's hat, I mean. There's I can literally only hear yourself. your voice. You can't very well cook without it. Twice. Hmm. Well, uh... <coughs> the lady goes... Like, I'm like, why are you surprised? She goes, well, I didn't expect... You know, the gourmet was a Khajiit. Because, you know, the, the, the shedding hair and all. And I go, that's racist. If you gotta take all of the cheese, like. I stole the cheese. <laughs> if you, and if the you... hat. Yep, you, did, you got the hat. You got the hat. And Babada Boopity. <laughs> okay, that was really oh, Slightly. Absolutely brilliant. Now, now did just as I imagined. Yes, of course. <clears throat> the Emperor has requested your signature Massive dish. Durgan. The potage le magnifique. Type. I've taken the liberty of getting it started. How long ago did you get Skyrim? Oh, so uh, everyone makes the potage. one day after you left. I would be honored if we could make it. Oh. Off the so it all yeah. changed when the, the base Fire Nation attack. No, when the Fire Nation right didn't now. attack. <laughs> Which when the Fire Nation left. Yeah. Left to go to the beach. Carrots? <coughs> really? Okay. What next? For a week. And you've gotten that far? Seriously? Hmm. Yes, I guess I can see how that would add a more earthy texture. And oddly enough, we do have some on hand. Ah. Alright, ah. what next then? Of course, I'm sorry. One giant's toe. There. What? Uh, what next? Mm. So delicious! I swear. Is there a soul alive who doesn't enjoy the taste of? Sorry. Copyright. One cup of diced pork or meat. I have to say, the stew seems done. Add anything else and we may dilute the distinct flavor. So, is that it? Oh, what is this? Some kind of herb? Are you sure? I dare you, I dare you to try the stream at, um, any other ingredient might... 1080. Hmm. <laughs> I'm sorry. Of course, it's your most famous recipe after all. Alright then, your secret ingredient's been added. If I may say so, 
It has been an honor getting a chance to prepare a meal with, well, the I'll give it a shot. The entire empire. Don't, because it might the crash. And lead the way up to the dining room. You're right, I don't want to lose this footage. I've been streaming for how long now? <laughs> Probably in two hours and maybe half of an hour. I could tell you, but I'm watching it on the PlayStation. Ta -da. Three hours. Three hours. I'm no longer a chef. I am now a jester. You're... Oh, so you're wearing the... The mad person that you can hear all the way through the tunnels for no yep. reason at all? Even though he's bleeding out on the ground, yep. You know what? This I don't like this outfit. Um, I would drop this, but this is absolutely necessary. Don't you agree? Uh, what? Just, just, oh just... yes, that's definitely that is yeah, totally. Uh let's see, what do I not need? Sell things. Just start just sell everything. You definitely gonna need the cheese. Oh you drop cheese. That's a lot Wait. of cheese. <laughs> Tim's like, why do you need that? Wait, that there was Pac-Man. Pac There's the sliced cheese. Not that one. The waka, other waka, one. waka, 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 waka. The yellow one. Yeah, that one. The goat cheese, I think. Mm -hmm. <laughs> waka, waka, waka. Alright, actually, I probably shouldn't wear the jester outfit, because then they'll think I'm just a jester. And then you'll stab them right in the dope. Much better. That really serious peasant armor coming in hot. I could just completely blow my cover and throw on the uh, dark assassin outfit. <laughs> Do it, you will. No, you're right. Wedding dress, definitely you won't. Here we are. God's Put on the wedding dress. We'll go in just a moment. Please, I'll serve. You just stand there and be amazing. It's not a dress, it's just a cloak. I know, right? Oh, okay. Um, um. Casual Wait, outfit, well, casual outfit. They're talking about the assassination that I performed not even an hour ago. <laughs> um, uh, I, I shouldn't put that outfit on. Bump it! Yes. Now they won't know. But an isolated incident. And I have been assured that the fault you didn't change. Oh. Oh! What are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> uh, uh, the truth is, we are in no danger whatsoever. Killing an emperor can. Like here, let me just wait. Wait right there. I'm like, go walk back out and put on a pant. Put on <laughs> freaking armor. They didn't even look at you. Uh, here we are. <laughs> just flip the table over them. They're just still talking, <laughs> and, and there's and their wine glass is just floating there, and you're just like, "Ow!" So, I, I would like to buy that friends, or steal it. As emperor, I of course reserve the right. <laughs> you just pull <laughs> out. Ooh, a sweet roll. Oh, mm, he's candy. Mm, he's candy. It is I want to hear this time. Shoot Be quiet for a second. No, I poisoned him. I think something's wrong. I... <laughs> why, are you, why is he looking at you? What? Yeet! No, oh, dang it! I can't jump out that window! <laughs> Did you just walk into the window? <laughs> I tried to jump out. Alright, now they've cornered you. Or have they? Ah, swords! You forget, just Ben. The shield. I have lots of weapons on me. <laughs> I never go into and combat weapons. without a stupid amount of 
close. <laughs> it's like, like I never go into combat without a weapon. Well, yeah, you have fists, don't you? I have claws. And that do fists. 15 damage. How much does your swords do? Uh, 60 something? The one on the right, the 60 something you know damage. The katana? The katana. But the one with blue on it. Help, or purple. No witnesses. <laughs> well, you said no witnesses! <laughs> Oh, oh, <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> you just like picked him up. That man was by far the most insufferable decoy the Emperor has ever employed. I'm glad he's dead. But I'm even happy that you killed him. You, an assassin for the Dark Brotherhood. Just made an attempt on the Emperor's life. Would have succeeded had it been the real man. Surprised? So was I when a member of your family came to me with a plan. We worked out a deal, you see. An exchange. Wait, I got sold out? I get you, and the Dark Brothers gets to continue its existence. But you know what? I've changed my mind. How about this? I kill you and butcher each and every one of your miserable little friends. Oh, you're gonna die. You killed my son. All of you. Who did it? I can't hear the dialogue as well. Kill him. Make sure there's nothing left to bury. Okay. You know what? You wanna slaughter me and all my friends? I'm putting on the serious outfit. I feel like oh crap. They done messed up now. They done messed up a a wrong. So much for special guards. Good, good grief. Those guys were easier to kill than the normal Imperials. It's like That's special just sad. guards. Their special guards <coughs> have specially low health. Just casually blood on the swords, just walking around town. All right, but you just watch yourself. <laughs> Next time, I might not be so lenient. Beach. Level. Why is that a level? Speech level? Oh, it's for persuasion and intimidation. Oh. I'm like, yes, I can speak. No, you get back here. Zero Swiggity swoogity. <laughs> well, no, that wait. Wait, he just went into the thing. Where'd he go? Huh? I'm staying out of this. this mission is taking a while. I mean, yeah, it's literally an assassination attempt on the new em empire. Not even the entire empire. You're gonna have to kill it. Yep. All of it. Innocent citizens. Everything. What a waste. Including the plants. Who's next, huh? Did you just kill all of the guards? Who's next? I dare you to attack the kill one with only your claws. You want me to kill one of these guys with just my claws? Don't. Yeah. A wee bit there, cheese scrub. Yo, wait, what the heck? Why are you trying to kill me? Where you at, fool? It's like, Mato Mano. <laughs> I 
I guess there's nobody left to kill. Oh, no. I need to pop a stamina potion so I can hurt this guy even worse. Eh, eh, eh. That was more than just one stamina potion. Eh, eh, eh. Eh, eh, eh. Die, die. He's just like, oh no. I think your partner is doing more damage. Well, he's one of the NPCs that you can't kill, so I'll just have to settle for beating him to death. Or at least temporarily. <laughs> Why- why did you join this thing if they're gonna, like, try to, like, kill I everything? Listen, man, I didn't know that I'd get stabbed in the back. But before the stream, when I joined them, they threatened to kill my family if I didn't join them, so... It's like, yeah, you kill my family, I'll just adopt more. Oh, no, I'm not getting another wife, man. <laughs> No, I didn't say anything about that. I said adopt. Oh, the kids? Yeah. I mean, yeah, they're not that special. Exactly. I did give them a ton of gold, so I would want that back, but, you know. No, I was like, er early in the stream, you said, I would adopt you, but you could only have two children once. <laughs> if that sounded like I was hinting at letting them die, no. I didn't no, mean for it to no. sound like that. <laughs> just cat, I don't, just, just walking by places like, I don't have parents, can you adopt me? Sure. <laughs> Zero armor, so it's just like, decor. I'll hail the new emperor. <laughs> uh, wait, what? Is that you? I put on the emperor's outfit. That means I'm the emperor, right? That's how that works. Yeah, that's 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 how it works. If you um, if you wear the emperor's clothes, you are the emperor. Mhm. Mm okay. Grief. I don't know why this mission in particular is taking a while. But hey, whatever. I mean, That's just a theory. A bing theory. And cut. Horses and horse drawn are coming. Means of transportation. Okay. Oh yeah, that's right, they were gonna kill all my friends. Serious armor. Are you <laughs> ready to rumble? <laughs> well, that was, uh... All of them with, like, uh, two stabs. <sighs> well, that was... Whoa, they did die. I, I don't think they could kill all your family and friends. That was pretty easy. Cheese. I think the children would have put up like a good fight against them. The paddle wants that Anakin slaughtered would have put up a better fight. <laughs> <laughs> Dang. It's an upgrade. That's my friend! Arbjorn! Are you okay? <gasps> no! Arbjorn! Torbjorn? I will avenge you, comrade! Wait, is that the person that you're looting? Yes. <laughs> I will avenge you! Oh, I mean... Yeah, free loot. 
mean, I don't think he'll need the gold. Die, anymore. you son of a gun. This is what you get for Burn. killing my friends. Burn. Honestly, Wait. I might be a vampire with a weakness. Oh, hey, Nazir! You're still alive. And then she and they get stabbed. Is that the um person with the uh, bounties? Maybe I did. Or at least you can still get bounties, you know. Sorry, I just now sort of erased any doubts. Thanks. You've got that right. Only a matter of time before roasted alive. Come on. Listen. I am your only salvation. Come embrace. YOLO The only Wait, wait, did you get in the Why didn't you just go out the exit, real question? I don't know. It told me to get in the coffin, so I went into the coffin. On the bright side, they won't have to bury me if I die. I'm already in a coffin. <laughs> and they have free coffin. I'm going. Yo, is that my daughter? That that I just heard in the background? You stupid she devil. I don't see you. Yes, I think maybe, maybe not. I don't know. Oh no, it's a vampire check. Dang. <laughs> Maybe your daughter is a vampire. Da, da, da. No, the 300 year old vampire earlier, the assassin. There. Yeah, I know. I think so. Just hold on a moment. You must speak with Astrid. I'm gonna start picking whether between those six and the one with that. Hey, it's Nazir. Wait, didn't wouldn't he have died because he was nowhere near the exit? Let's go. Did he just hop in a casual coffin right next to you? Nope. This is the only coffin in the entire place. So we hopped in the same one. No, because he was the one who pried <laughs> it open. Then why did you get in it? Alive. You're alive. Free weapon. Please. There isn't much that I have to say. And not much time. <coughs> I'm sorry. So very sorry. Penitus Oculatus. Nero, he said that by giving you to them, he would leave the Dark Brotherhood alone. Forever. Oh, but Sivis, I was such a fool. She was the one that sold me out. It's all my fault. Piece of crap. I mean, she looks like one. You. Ah, it's easy to kill everyone else. No, don't pity me. I deserve whatever fate the Dread Lord has in store. I betrayed you, and now Nero has betrayed me. I think you should pity her. I just wanted she said not to. to stay the way they were. Before Cicero. Before the Night Mother. Before I'm just gonna... You... I thought I could save us. Can I just stab her and then her misery? But you are alive. Or just let's just send her to the pit of misery. Uh, a chance to start over. Uh, do we have one of those? Uh, not don't. anymore. Kind of collapsed. That's why I did. <laughs> Feed her to the spider. Oh wait, that died too. I killed you killed it. Mother. 
No, I went to the safe before I killed it. I know, I know, I know. I'm saying you were right. The night mother was right. The old ways. They guided the dark motherhood for centuries. This is a very long mission. <laughs> Three hour mission. Sincerity. I have prayed for a contract. You lead this family now. I give you the blade of woe. So uh, you, you don't have to give me that. I stole it right next to you. you. Must kill. Lols. Oh, I have to kill her with her own blade. Okay. You know what? I wanted to do that oh, anyway because right. you sold me out. Uh, anyone who has a sensitive stomach, I'm surprised you haven't already clicked away because there's a burnt corpse right in front of me. Yeah. Thank you. I thought. Yeah, you stabbed her right in the leg. I'm dead now. Ba 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 ba. Why did that? I gotta go, my dudes. See you later. All right, see you, man. Thanks for tuning in. Uh, hopefully you had a good time here. Uh, see you next stream. Hopefully. Astrid is dead. That is loud. It is as it should be. May she find redemption. Have you ever, have you ever realized that uh, Astrid is also the name of the person from How to Train Your Dragon? But while you live, the dark brotherhood lives. She's talking we to me through the coffin. Yeah, <laughs> I don't want to hear this. Must be eliminated. I heard kill. Speak with Amon. Nope, never mind. Here. Somebody's just like talking to you. Blah blah blah. blah. You don't even really pay attention. They said the word kill you. The what? <laughs> but first, inform Nasir of your plans. For you are the listener. And must find this family together. If I hadn't heard it with my own ears, I wouldn't have believed it. Sandra, still can't wrap my head around it. Strangely. By Sithis, what a mess. I guess this is the end. What? Well, what did she say? Amand Motier? But that would mean... You mean there's still a chance? But how? Our plan has gone to ruin. Everyone is dead. The family. <laughs> All right then. Go. Go, my listener. Find out what that slimy bastard Motier has to say. <laughs> then send the Emperor to Sithis. Ah, but when you're done, there's no use returning here, is there? I was thinking. The Dawnstar Sanctuary. We could make a proper home there. Listen, when you're finished with this emperor business, meet that bet and me there. I'll find some way to move the night mother. I is back. Don't worry. Okay. Now go. And come back with a barrel full of gold, huh? He wants me to bring him a bunch of gold. I can literally just give him, like, uh, let's see. How much do I have on him? I have 100... And sixty six thousand. I can give him sixty K right now. And it like not even just worry about you know. the it, might, it, might, it, pays, it puts a pretty big dent but I have an infinite supply. So What do you, I, what do you mean infinite supply? I can craft gold coins. With what? One gold ingot for one K. And since I have free crafting I can craft an infinite amount. <laughs> you know? So you're cheating. It, mod. It's a mod, not a cheat. So you're cheating. I will stab you. In the Try me. foot. Try me. Ninja is a streamer that died three days ago. What? what 
Okay. Yeah. Didn't you see the new episode of Pew News? No. He died. If it's work you need, how about chopping up some wood? Mad because bad. What is it? I said I didn't wish to be disturbed. You're alive, but I had heard your sanctuary. I oh, you should have gone the second You mustn't think I had anything to do with that. Yep. I wanted the emperor dead, the true emperor. I still do. It was Morrow. He. You mean after all that's transpired, the Dark Brotherhood will still honor the contract? Why, this is astounding news! Wonderful news! The emperor is still in Skyrim, but not for long. He's on board his ship, the Kataraya, moored offshore in the Solitude Inlet. But you must hurry. If you can get on board, Alright, we'll then go to the place Keep where he... The second, if he's going the out of Skyrim... The location of the dead drop that holds your then just follow him. Please yep. I think I'm just gonna get on his boat. But why would it... Why would you ever want to name a place Skyrim? Because it's the room of sky. But let's proceed to work. It's the rim of the sky. Well, you know, that kind of makes sense now. One second, be right back. Idle character is the best live stream, you know? Yeah. yeah. There's probably is somebody on YouTube that does, uh... Well then, um... This is kind of awkward. That is a lot of, um, gold. Yeah. If I go to jail, I'd have to wait so many hours in real life. So you paid? Mm hmm. I paid her off. What? Dang. I mean, you do a free crafting. Or should I say cheat crafting? Listen, man. <laughs> I don't have to put up with this. Yes, you do. <laughs> Serving jail time causes some skills to lose their accumulated progress to progress to the next level. So don't go to jail because you might lose all that hard-earned one-handed XP. Oh my gosh. You know what that's a reference to, right? Maybe. The thing that single people do with their right hand, usually? Ah, give themselves high fives. <laughs> yes. Because they're lonely. Yes. Yeah, why would you? Why? Why? Why, why would you? Why would you think that it meant something else? You dirty-minded freaks oh, yeah. of viewers. You Just know, like what happened with the new um, Niga Higa video. He, Where it, do you find all of those names? One of his comments. Uh, one of the comments he he did for the Dear Ryan episode was go f asterisk 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 yourself and he made it look like that there was going to be something intimate about to happen and then he went one two three go and he turned it around and it was like see i told you it wouldn't be that easy to find yourself get Whoa. it hide and seek <laughs> find instead of <laughs> f word <laughs> That is a boat. That doesn't even it's look that good. It's the Imperial's boat. Can it I just use fire magic good. to set this thing on fire? I I much rather not have that ginormous red bow boat term. Wait, what? Can I just? Oh yeah, unanger it. 
Wait, did you just climb in through the little anchor slot? I think so. And that's the last one. All right, enough of this. But um, I'm gonna go suggest getting a Luigi's pizza. But um, but um, but um, but um, but um, but um. Are you sure it's fake boxes? How much damage does this shank do? Oh my word, for a knife that's amazing. You know what, to avoid getting damage. detected... Put the other I'm just gonna sword go... away, cause it's huge! Yeah. Come on, let's get something to eat. Oh shoot. Can't be glad to see oh wait, I just realized there's an arrow quiver on my back that could be easily spotted. No, it's just like, you know, the, what's it called? You know what I'm talking about. Did you just pickpocket him? You just one-shot him. You're not even concerned with the fact that I literally just slit someone's throat? Okay. <laughs> yeah, no. <laughs> There's a, more important factors. Are like, you just one-shot him. Was he, did he have like 22 or 1 HP? I can like hear what's about to happen before it happens. Another. Oh, well, you just lighten, lightning slit his neck. That ain't variance to this. <laughs> Another one. <laughs> and you just kicked him. Did you see what just happened? He got smited by my friend there. Like, I slice his neck, and then she's just like, I smite D. <laughs> and just yeah, zapped I, it. He's sent flying. Bye. <laughs> I might not be the right user for a knife like this, but uh, you know what? Yeah, I'm not. Yeah, I'd rather, I, I I'd rather use a sword. I've already been detected. <laughs> you're just you're just punching them in the face. It's like die. I'm already detected, so I might as well <laughs> just swap to my you know big boy weapons and whatnot. So. Just one shotting big faces. Why don't you just slit their neck with the sword? Do like a um. You know, and Okay, that was pretty dope. You, you just what? Did you just one shot them? Yeah, it would appear so. <laughs> All right, now that I've killed the bridge crew, this boat. I just can go back down to the lower floor. I always make it's it a personal thing to make sure that there's no reinforcements. You know? Real question is, if this is an emperor boat, wouldn't there be so many, like, like, so many guards on there? And why is there, like, no protection at all around it? It's just there. Mm -hmm. Yep, there's that buddy that got smited. Need a key. Wait, Where detected? By who? Oh, that guy. Okay, whatever. Oh, he's dead. <laughs> Wait, is he following you into... Oh. Time to lockpick. You're looting a pile of, like, ash. Okay, so it's not to the left, it's... Sorry, it is to the left. Alright, farther left. Okay, so it's not that far left. It's just left of here. Okay, so... Got it! Let's go. Draw a knife. And then we'll just... How many lockpicks do you have? Nice and simple assassination. If he was asleep, then how did he go? Oh. Shoot, you can't get detected. Done. Done.
Get out of the way, useless side character. Oh wait, you're a special guy. You think you're special, huh? You think you're special, huh? You think you're special? I can kill you with just a no. Oh, oh, oh. Hey, why would you, you only have three gold? That's like... That escalated quickly. Uh, you could say that again. <laughs> <laughs> that escalated quickly. <laughs> it just like started, it just went from, you know, having a nice knife fight, and then you just dropped off his head with a freaking knife. A knife! Yep. That's... Just standing in the door. Oh, you did it again. <laughs> Oops, I did it again. <laughs> No one will understand that reference because it's from the 90s. I, I knew what it was. I like that helmet. It's a Spartan helmet. It looks cool. Oh. And once more, I prove Commander Morrow the fool. I told you, you can't stop the Dark Brotherhood. Never could. Kill. 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 Come up behind him and kill him. How do you say his last name? Oh, you can say Mead. Sinister Bravado. Or Med. I'll not go to my grave whimpering like an infant. I know why you're here. I must die. And you Is he about to put up a fight? <laughs> the old unarmed man. Yeah, right. <laughs> Picks up like, like a little, like, a feather, like or one of those things you use, right? Ink pen. A quill? Not pen. Quill, yeah, there. And just starts fighting your knife. And you're like, how is this not cutting through it? Let's be done with it then. I gotta say that knife kind of looks a little weird. <laughs> Dang! You just like, you just stood up and. He's dead. Stand up. Sit down. <laughs> I think you should uh, try a lockpick. Yeah. Huh? I have the key to it, so I don't have Easy. to. Easy. No, I'm talking about the thing that you like were looking at in the case. Oh, it's not worth it. What is it? Oh, it's just a dwarven mace. It's pretty useless, actually, compared to the stuff I've First got. First of all, why would you? Fourteen gold in the. That's a lot. Alright, that's actually... That's worth stealing. Hollow Dwarven Bow. But I'm not gonna do it. <laughs> Cause I have better. Yeah. Sell it. I don't need to though. What is that? Why don't you just get a mod for if it's infinite inventory space? <coughs> oh, you mean like unlimited weight? I was actually yeah. looking at a mod for that earlier today. I figured, nah. I already have one OP mod. I don't need two. What? Recasting? Yeah. Or do you mean cheating? Okay, it's not cheating. <laughs> Crafting right, isn't even that cheating. big of a thing in this game. But buying is. Yeah. Yes. And you know what you can do with crafting? A wee bit there, Chi. Fair. That is fair. Jump. You won't. Oh well. Do it. I did. <laughs> Are you going to the very bottom? Oh, that looks weird because you're looking down and swimming up, just like. I'm sorry. I have a contract for you. <laughs> <laughs> These horkers put up more of a fight than the Imperial Guards. Until they try to run. And you're right, why don't you just get a bunch of them? And wait, use them as literal meat shields. <laughs> oh wait, if they tried to train them. 
the, the guards trying to train them would probably die. Like, so I have a contract for all of you. Alright, finally I get to finish up the stupid Dark Brotherhood quest line. Well, it's not stupid, but you know what I mean. Very long. I started the stream off just starting it. <coughs> Four hours later. You know. Just for one quest line. Which honestly, considering the amount of stuff I had to do, I'd say that was pretty good. That was a pretty good time. Oh, I thought that was an Imperial Guard. I know, I know. I received the news not moments ago. <laughs> this is glorious. My oh, friend, he's crazy. Not be enough, but you have served the Empire. Indeed, all of Tamriel in ways you cannot possibly imagine. Ah, but you care little for politics, am I right? You want money, and money you shall have. Your payment waits for you at a dead drop. It is inside an urn, in the very chamber where we first met, in Volunru. Now please, go. Collect your money, and let us never look upon one another again. Our business, thank the gods, is concluded. Hey, you jerk. What is this madness? But we had a deal. Are you killing him? Uh Time to end this little game. Later, nerd. Him? Oh no, he went full dead instantly. Because I finished his quest line. He no longer has a plot importance. So he became <laughs> insta kill. No plot. Hey man, you wanna try to hit me? Oh, you don't. What say you in your Just running at you with a sword. Oh, a mace, my bad. Are you, are you trying to do a um, run through without going to jail? Mm-hmm. I've already completed the original quest line, like where I kill Alduin. So technically I did complete the game without any arrests, so. Just in, an entire day? <laughs> or do you mean... One second stream. <laughs> Anyone know where Bean just went? Here, one second, stream, mama. Shoot Ben a text message. See if he's, uh, like what just happened. <laughs> Let's see how much moolah I get for this. Oh, wow. Twenty grand. <laughs> wow, that's that's something right there. Twenty K. 
Are you kidding me? more wondrous news recent events notwithstanding this is a happy day for us my friend despite your misfortunes you stay true to the dark brotherhood you've saved us all and for this you have my eternal praise. now of course i must ask killing the emperor how much did motier pay for such a thing ha remarkable well, the old bastard certainly made it worth your while, didn't he? Now, might I offer some advice? You should go to Riften and find Delvin Mallory. I believe Astrid had you visit him once before. Mallory is an expert obtainer of goods. We can use the money to repair and refit the sanctuary. Make a true home for us, huh? You do that. And I'll see what I can do about recruiting some new additions to our family. It is done. Emperor Titus Mede II lies dead. And the Dark Brotherhood yet lives. Okay, stream. I'm gonna go ahead and say this now. But our work is just beginning. I have no Approach clue what happened to them. But he just got back on, so my words. doesn't really matter anymore. You know? Hey, I was just talking about you. Scotty. Hello. And he's back. Alright, are you gonna my stay life, or life. leave? <laughs> my life I died. And then you were not tight. Okay. <coughs> All right. So. Okay. There's a dragon right next to me. It's a revered dragon. Let the Durgans consume you. I don't know what that is. Revered. Yeah. All revered. Uh, actually, revered means, uh, like they're recognized and feared. Do they have, like, a name? No. So, then how do they recognize it? Because it has a specific pattern on its back, maybe? I don't know. Don't ask me that. Because of, you know, that... That scar that's... You know... On its face. And, you know... Are you thinking of what movie I'm trying to... Recognize? Scarface? No. Godfather? Oh. I wasn't listening to what you're saying. I was shooting at the dragon. I'm sorry. What? <laughs> okay, it's not. No. Sorry. What were you saying? Sorry. Eh. You get back here, you son of a biscuit. Your mother was a biscuit. Your father was gravy. Mm. 
Yo, I don't know how I'm hitting these shots. How do I not like? Why is this thing not dying? You see this? <laughs> its health bar is non-existent. Maybe it's just there in spirit. Maybe you've already consumed it. What the f is this thing doing? The dragon. Or should I say Gurgan consumes you? Okay, he's dead now. So you're done with the quest. So I get to play a game now. Yeah. Um. You want to play H1? Sure. All right. I just gotta go buy some stuff right quick. All right. You wanna like maybe make some? Oh. Oh, dude. For assassinating the emperor, I got 20k gold. Only 20k? Ben. My bounty after killing 20 guards was 10k. Oh, so he's, he's worth 20 people. Oh. No, 40. Why, 40 guards. guards are worth two? I mean, if you kill 10 guards, and you got 10k. Yay, an ad. Wait, was there an ad on my live stream? No. Oh. <laughs> I was about to say I'm moving on up. I got an ad on my video. <laughs> wow. <laughs> my first ad. <clears throat> know what I'm saying, man? I mean, that would have been cool. Yeah, it would have been a milestone for sure, because that means I'm, I'm going to be able to get paid soon. For this. Ad rev. <laughs> and that means you need, we need an editor. Is that where you lot right? Up? Right? Uh, mm -hmm. Tell you what, it right? Cost you. Yes, right. Right. I mean, right. I'm <laughs> gonna hurt you. I am getting the computer, so we can do some Steam stuff. Yeah. Bad we'll play CS. Try to put you to place up. CS, no. Hmm. Looking for wood. Of course I do. Yeah, that will carry anything. And I'll be stationed. Maybe a little garden with some choice plants. Alright? Consider it done. It's a gold. Tell me what you mean. Uh, uh, now that's the dark brotherhood I know and love. Wait, what did I just buy from him? Business or pleasure. Uh, a burger. No, but can you rewatch the stream? Uh, new banners. Right after that. Sorry, two after that. Uh, a prison. Uh, poisoner's nook. Prisoner's nook? Okay, no, one after that. Need to go. Alright, what's your. Chamber, fit for a king and torture a chamber. Right. Oh, <laughs> I just purchased a torture chamber. Of course, you know. <laughs> well, well, <laughs> extra bubbles. <laughs> uh, collapsed. <laughs> it was like a a, a minute delay on the stream. I hope the place is what are you? Are you streaming in like in eighty? Good luck with your Canadia. Murders. No, ten eighty. Ten eighty p? No. Still 720. Uh, well, there, it's, it was just like 10 seconds a while ago. Your Wi-Fi must be dying. Actually, maybe you just need to fast forward. No. You might be behind. I mean, now I am. See? Go forward. <laughs> okay, so... Do you mind if I, like, go and see what I just perched, like, the new... Dark Brotherhood area. 
Because I'm curious. Okay, I'm gonna check it out. Because <laughs> I just spent like 20k on all that stuff. <laughs> I just spent all of my new bounty money on so basically refurbishing. You broke Ethan. Yeah, pretty much. And if we're counting the 10 grand from the uh, like bounty that I had to pay off for the job, I uh, went negative 10k. <laughs> So, uh, yeah. And a bunch of- and probably like another 2,000 because of all the guards you ran into. And... No, actually. Probably more. I mean, if you actually have the time and dedication to go in and look, I mean, you do that, man. But I'm not. I'm like, <laughs> I'd rather not. I have more important things to do, like, play... H1Z1. Yeah. Yet another child nope, close. has prayed to the mother. Yep, I don't know what we're talking about. Speak with a nervous patron at Candlehawk Hall in Windhelm. Did you just close the open it and close the coffin? No. Oh. So Real question, how is that coffin still there? That's a torture chamber. If I've ever seen one. You know what, this lady's just strutting me. She said, do you have any idea who I am when my father finds out about what happened? You're dead. You know what? Torture. 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 No, don't kill her. Torture. Yeah, I know. I'm trying to find my least painful weapon. Eight damage. Okay, so I'll use this with an iron arrow. Wait, no, just click torture. Because there's a button. Wait, seriously, there's a button for it? This is about my father's giving cachet, isn't it? The dowry for my wedding. Uh, did you just shoot her in the knee? That didn't even do that much damage. Okay, I'm done messing with her. <laughs> You know what? I pity you, so I will, uh, I will give you some whoa, whoa wiki. Yo, this lady be strong. They should have hired her to protect. Oh my gosh! How? Wow! Without any armor on, too. I'll leave. I'll just leave. So who's oh. next? <laughs> what the heck? Oh yeah, that's Cicero from earlier. Oh, Wait, use the um stake. The stake? What? The thing next to behind you. Oh, it doesn't let me use those as a weapon. Sorry. Uh. Hey, I wish really I could much. use those. Wait, what about that little fire, the thing right over next to you? That's a- Dude, that's a branding iron! What the heck? Exactly! <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh! <laughs> this just got demented. De demented? Spider eye? Like, Minecraft? Hmm. And it's not demented spider eye, it's fermented spider eye. I know, I know. Who do, I, who do you think I am? Somebody that never uses them in potion brewing? Yeah. <laughs> if I'm being right. honest. I only use normal spider eyes. What the heck? Wait, who are these guys? Oh, the Dawn Guard. Okay. Oh, dang. I was just about to log what? off. No, oh, let's stop. Dog. 
I just realized the Dawn Guard knows where the secret entrance is to the uh, base now. <laughs> to the uh, secret base. Now they have to die. I'd get no fired. survivors. Or witnesses. <gasps> no! This. I mean. That guy's the only. Re I'm the only reason that guy even got into the Dawn Guard in the first place. Yo. Before I joined the vampires, I helped that guy join the Dawn Guard. So you just killed the person you just helped. Good job. Not Good. just helped, I helped him like two days ago. That's just help. Did you see that? What? Alright, so hopefully you guys enjoyed oh. the live stream. If you did, hit it up with a like. And I'll see you dudes in the next stream.